Oh, I can't hear it. Do I have the 4K open? We have a special guest this morning. Hi. Such a good boy. He's Parin. Parin, so good. Do I just not have sound because of... Did you turn my sound down? I cannot tell. Oh, yep, there it is. So you did turn my sound down. That's not very nice of you. He's purring up a storm. He's pretty happy. <laughs> Look at him. Oh my goodness, you're just so sweet. Such a good boy. Hi Tiki. Tiki does not even realize that I am holding Bo. Which is, in itself, very spooky. Ayo! Thanks for stopping by, man. Also, hi Shiny Mash. How are you? Did I say that right? I might have said it wrong. I'm very bad with uh, with names. Currently, we have special guest Karibo, uh, who's just having an adventure on my lap. And he's he's free to go whenever. He just sometimes prefers the lap. Well, you want to go now? If you're going to bother your sister, you're not going that way. Go that way. Thank you. Kribo also tried to turn off my PC immediately after uh, <laughs> after turning on the uh, stream. So that's always lovely too. Uh, how are we doing today on this lovely Sunday? I say lovely, but in reality, it's snowing and it should, no, honey, no. He's now trying to eat my fake plants. Oh, are you okay? Did you fall? Poor honey. As always, very chaotic start to the stream. I also have to make a make a good old fashioned tweet while we try and get a raid to start everything off. Okay. Who says Twitter's dead? Am I right? Oh, you went in the closet. Four. Come. Twitter, yes. I want to enable the join. I like to always put like a tweet out so that people know that I'm live. Although I do have a more structured schedule now, which I am proud to say is currently Saturdays and Sundays. Yeah, it's X, but I'm never going to call it X. I'm just going to keep calling it Twitter. Because it's just, I mean, if you say X, I know what you mean. If you say Twitter, I know what you mean. It's just kind of like a, eh, you know, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe people prefer to call it X, but I, I prefer to call it Twitter. And also, so what? So when, what do you call a a tweet? Then, like, if everything is X related, do you call it just a, like a? I made an X on the X. That's the question. I'm also doing Blastoise raids, because I feel like, Chestnut? I feel like these are the best uh, raids to try and get herb. Just, you know. Because at least they'll give you one. X is such awkward name, especially when talking to older people. I start to get paranoid. Like, what if they're not in the loop and I'm referring to a sus site? True, true, like an X-rated site. You would think, right? 
it's uh it's all stupid i'm just you know i have a love-hate relationship with twitter a lot of people hate twitter and there are some not great people on twitter right don't get me wrong but uh i just i'm just waiting for twitter to just go down to just go down in case you hear crackling in the background that is karibo trying yet again to eat my fake flowers. Thank you, buddy. Buddy, no. You can't... You can't eat the fake flowers. Hold on. I need to make a move. I can't... Ayo, ayo. Happy Sunday. Uh, what did I need to do? I shouldn't have body crossed, but... Come here. A little nutcase. Stop eating my fake plants! Go! And that is how you mother a cat. <laughs> he loves me. Every time I pick him up, he purrs. So he can't really hate me that much. But pup! Go! Do you like your, do you like your little frog? It's so cute. I'm gonna cheer again. Go! Oh! Oh! Five cats. Give we have three cats. Give me all your cat names. I love I love bonding over cats. Cats are so good. So pure, so chaotic. How can you not love a good cat? Truly. We'll probably get more cats uh when we're not in a small confined place space. But, uh, three is most certainly enough right now, I would say. We have, uh, a young boy, which is Karibo. The middle child that is Tiki. And, uh, our old man, Toji. Two tuxedos and a... Uh, long-haired cat. Yes, of course. Okay, good. And when we move into a house, we're getting a possum. Tater, Lucy, Beans, Ricky, and Lulu. Those are all really good names. I especially like Tater. And Beans! Ah, uh, good names, good names. Love it. My uh, dog, when I had a dog, oh my god, that went really loud in my ear. Um, my dog, her name was Lily, but we always called her Lulu. So I love Lulu for a name. Such a good solid name. <sighs> Tater was on the side of the road along with Lulu. Uh, so they're bonded. That's such a good heartwarming story, man. I love that. I'm just waiting for the cat distribution system to hit us with cats. Because I'm sure it's going to happen. I would not, not even doubt it. That it'll happen eventually. Two or three weeks old. Oh, poor babies. Why do people leave cats on the side of the road like that? Like, that's sickening. We adopted all of our cats. Because, I mean, I don't even, I feel like it's also easier to get, like, a cat breeder, or a dog breeder, than, like, a cat breeder. Not that I would want, like, a purebred cat, because I don't care, a cat's a cat. But, they're four or five months old, no! What, like, are they, like, what color are they? Are they tuxedo? Are they black? Are they orange? Are they, I gotta know. I gotta know everything about these cats now. Tiki and Toji look very like orange and black. Oh, good babies. Eventually, we want an orange cat. Dakota wanted an orange cat when we went to adopt Toji, but Toji kind of stole our hearts because he's eight years old, and he was a stray for a majority of his life, and he is the sweetest little boy. Tater's orange. Oh, Tater. 
that makes sense to have the tater name. The the only name that we kept for our cats was Tiki, because Tiki's a great name. Uh, Toji's name was originally Boots, but he's adopted the name Toji because uh, he really didn't have a name for the mo majority of his life, but originally they tried to name him Boots. Sweet Potato! I love that. Little Sweet Potato. What a baby. I can, like, just picture it. Oh, also, thank you for the follow. And my noises work. Hell yeah. Sweet Potato. What a good name. Oh, and Karibo, who we just call Bo um, a majority of the time. He, his original name was Holland. But he's also a very young boy. He's turning two in July. We got him when he was, uh, seven months old. So. His, Tiki is, uh, Tiki Marie. Uh, Karibo is Karibo the pup. And then Toji's just kind of Toji right now. <laughs> You'll probably see Tiki at some points because Tiki is my number one fan. No matter what I do, she has to follow. Oh, they're from different litters? So they just set, so they're not even like, that's sad, but at least they're like brother and sister, kind of, right? I guess they had to bond. Hi, Lena, how are you? I'm talking to two chats right now, just saying. So, if, if anyone gets confused, I'm live on YouTube, and I am, in fact, live on Twitch. So, I'm talking to two at the same time. I watched a movie recently called The Black Cat from the 30s. Very disappointed to learn the cat only... Uh, five minutes of screen time? How are you gonna name a movie The Black Cat and give the cat five minutes of screen time? I feel like that should be illegal. But I'm glad that you were able to save them, Shiny. You're a saint. The cat distribution system loves you. With little Sweet Potato and Lulu. You're good? Good! How's your Sunday going? This is- I would not be able to dual stream on, uh, on two monitors. <laughs> it, I would not be able to do dual stream if I didn't have two monitors. God forbid. Oh, but yeah, I love... I was a dog person for a while in my life, right? I had a dog. Her name was Lily. Lily passed away last year. She was 18 years old. And, um... But I didn't really like cats. I was very afraid of them. So... But I learned to love cats, and now I have three of them. It sucks that you have school tomorrow. Oh, I'm sorry, man. I Listen, once you get through school, though, it's, like, and then enter, like, sometimes, I miss school. I won't lie. <laughs> it's alright so far. Good. Got any good plans for the week? Resetting? I used to be afraid of cats, too. I... When I was younger, my mom and dad were like, we want a pet. And I mean, I was like four or five, right? And they got this kitten. And this kitten, I guess, was like a nightmare kitten. Where it would... I have scars from this kitten. And I was never like a bad kid. And um, it was just like... They, they returned the cat to the to the person that we got it from because their cats had babies and but ever since then I was afraid of cats and uh, then my stepbrother when my mom got remarried he randomly brought his uh, cat into the mix Kramer who was also a tuxedo cat and Kramer was like one of the sweetest cats I'd ever met. So then I started to like cats more. And then I met Dakota, and Dakota had a cat named King. And King was just a sweetie pie. So, uh, 
when we moved in together, we were like, we're getting a cat. So we got uh, Tiki and then the rest followed. Muffin and my cat Tuxie are sleeping on my bed. Oh, good. Toji's sleeping in a uh, in the cat tree right now. And the other cats are awake, I think. I have a scarf from my great grandmother's cat. Yeah, that's the thing. There are some cats that just don't like, they just don't want to be touched. There was a dog who would run across the street and tackle me and my older brother. I am also afraid of big dogs. Or was afraid of big dogs. So that that kind of stuff can scar you. 100%. My stepfather's family also brought a big dog. And by big, I mean my dog was a Pomeranian poodle. So she was a little lappy dog. And um, the, the dog was like a... Uh, her name was Lexus. She was like a black Sharpe lab mix. And Lexus really, for whatever reason, didn't like me. And it, it, like I said, it's not because I was a jerk to the cat or a jerk to the dog. It just didn't like me. It would try to like get on top of me to assert dominance and like nip at me. And so one day we were doing a having a car ride and the dog uh, my younger stepbrother was messing with the leash of the dog, and I said, hey, it's probably annoying, stop that. And the dog t bit my head on the road trip. So, that got me afraid of big dogs. There was a dog who would run across the street and tackle me and my older brother. Oh my god. That's scary, too. And I also almost had a German Shepherd attack me. Because it had escaped the next door neighbors. And me and my grandmother were outside practicing golf swings. Because I was golfing back then. I know. <laughs> and um, the German Shepherd, I saw it and I was like, oh, honey, it's okay. Like, we'll get you back to your owner. And the dog came to attack me. Luckily, my grandmother, like, she just put up the golf club just to, like, intimidate it. Because it probably would have attacked me. And I love German Shepherds. I love the look of German Shepherds. They're so cute. <gasps> ah! You used one of the emotes! <laughs> I love it! Isn't it so cute? Oh, I love the possum emotes. Plan to reorganize my room? You know what? Organizing, Reorganizing a room is so therapeutic. I have to reorganize this office again. Because I, yet again, have too much stuff in a little space. But that's not shocking. Isn't it such a cute emote? Ah, I've been, for whatever reason, I've been obsessed with, like, possums and raccoons and just rats and just, like, within this last year. So I'm, like, when I saw that there were some, uh, emotes, I was like, yes! And I got them off Etsy. And they're very cute. I have to wait to check for new postings because I want to do another Blastoise raid before... I continue the hunt. Or actually, how many? But yeah, cats and dogs, I was I was scarred by both of them. But listen, you you bring me a tiny dog, I'm real chill with a tiny dog. I'm also chill with cats now. Cuz Tiki when we first when we first got her, she had been in the uh not adopt when she was in the adoption place she was in there we went there in january she had been there she was the longest resident there of uh <laughs> poor honey was there for like um how long she was there since october so she was there for like four months and i was like oh poor honey and then we went in the because she was in this room called the spirit cat room Right. And the spirit cat room is for uh, cats who either are were super shy or cats who just did not have a good attitude, I guess I should say. And um, so Tiki did, was one of the ones that didn't have a good attitude, but she tried to crawl into my lap when I first saw her. So I said, this is my cat. I looked up at Dakota and I was like, this is, this is the cat. And he was like, alright, that's the cat. So then we got her. And now she is, she's like my soul cat. 
you know, a very, very pleasant cat. Well, she's, and I say pleasant, but she was kind of a nightmare in the beginning, where she would, like, constantly want to attack and bite us for no reason. She still kind of bites, but not, definitely not as often as she did. And she's just, you know, she's just in her edgy teen phase, and that's fine. She's still my little lady, who I want to hold all the time. Now she asks for uppies to be held all the time. And, uh, she's just, she's a good cat. She's definitely, from where she was, like, a little over a year ago, she's 100% a lot better. Oh, look at the little lechong! Do you like my little emote wall? Because your emotes are popping up. What a good lechonk. Muffin started being nervous around bigger dogs due to some dogs in my neighborhood not being on a leash and running across the street. Oh my god. I am a firm believer that dogs should be leashed at all times. Especially because I have a fear of big dogs, kind of still. I just got a shiny one. Hey! You love to see it. I love Shiny Lechonk. It's very good. Alright. Let's. It's time! This is gonna be. This is Shiny Sandwich number six. It's pink, I know. That's why I love it. It's. I love Shinies that are, like, very drastically not uh, what they were before. Walking Wake, can we please take care of this Bruxish, please? <laughs> Thank you. Shiny Lechonk is very good. I also really like, um... What else do I like? There's also Shiny Ditto. Shiny Ditto's blue. Like, anyone that's, that's just drastically different. It's just like, yes. Yes, I love it. Even though Totodile's not, like, vastly different from the Shiny... It's still, like, green, so I'll be, still be able to tell. They should for sure... Many things could happen to a dog when they aren't on a leash. Exactly! Like, what if the dog accidentally tries to go, like, in the middle of the road? And gets hit by a car? I understand that dogs can be trained, right? Fully understand. But accidents can happen. And you want to be able to pull back. And be like, hey, bud. We're not going over there. Or, like, what if it gets into a scuffle with another dog? It's not fair. It's not fair to the... Y you, as an owner, have to be responsible for those types of things. I love Shiny Eevee. Shiny Eevee's also very good. I don't know if I have a favorite Shiny. I also love uh, Shiny Drowsy. <laughs> shiny Drowsy's also pink. What do you think about Shiny Gengar? I wish Shiny Gengar was... Uh, like the mega the shiny mega i wish it was like vastly different i don't shiny gengar is like eh you know it's and gengar is one of my favorite pokemon so it's like vastly disappointing but will i still also sh hunt for a shiny gengar eventually yeah but i wish it was different i wish the the mega I wish it was, like, white or even pink. Blue? Something of the sort. It's just a, a different, a slightly different color. Because of Pokemon Go, I got quite a few shiny Pokemon. Me too! I got, w when there was, like, a Froakie community day, I opened it up one day randomly. And I was, like, I got a shiny Froakie. Red. Oh, you want Shiny Gengar to be red? I think that'd be rad. Imagine if it was red and then its eyes were purple. Like, inverse. Or even the eyes stay red. I'm a big fan of red. And Kribo's back in the closet. Way to go, buddy. You're doing great. He takes, like, a leap of faith into the closet. You guys can't see it, but... What a, what a joy. I have 102 shiny and 24 legendary Pokemon. Oh my god. I pick up Pokemon Go sometimes. I like Pokemon Go, but I 
constantly forget I have it. And I also accidentally got logged out of it for like a year. I'm back into it now. But uh... I'll, I'll like open it if I remember. I find it cool that they still do the cool community days. You've been playing for almost one year and have 102 shiny Pokemon? That's a lot. You, you're definitely a certified shiny hunter. I only started getting into shiny Pokemon. Like, this year. Because I just really... I didn't realize how easy it was. And then I was like, you know what, we're just going to do it. So I did it. And now I have quite a few. And now I've just been shiny hunting. And actually, I take a lot of... Uh, I like it a lot. And two shiny legendary ones. Like, that's... That's a lot of skill. Did I play Pal World at all? I did not. And it's not... I have mixed feelings about Pal World. For people who like it, you know, good on ya. I, I just... I don't have time in my life to really play much else other than Pokemon a lot of the time. Or, or Pokemon Unite. Zekrom and Yuxi. Ooh. What is Yuxi shiny again? But, uh, I understand why people, like, liked Power World. I just didn't play it myself just because I, I don't physically have the time with all of the hobbies that I have. <laughs> and, uh, I don't know. I Everything is, it's, it's, the body's yellow. Ooh, I like that. I don't know. I have mixed feelings. Will I probably ever play it? Probably not. I do notice that some of the designs are definitely, uh, definitely Pokemon related. You know. But, I understand also Pokemon needing a, uh, like a, a competitive thing to get their game value up. I get that too. Did you play Pal World? And I'm also bad at shooting games. That is also a factor. Making Taco pasta? That actually sounds pretty good. I love pasta. I'm a big fan of pasta and pizza. Those are my two main food groups. I don't, I don't, I've never had a taco though. I don't mind taco meat, but all of it together. I have like a weird food OCD. I also don't eat sandwiches. I'm, I'm just a very odd personality to say the least. But if I ever go to, like, a restaurant, I will always find something. One time I went to a Subway and they had frozen pizza, so I got a frozen pizza from a Subway. They didn't even know they had it until they checked. College has taken up most of my time, but I have tried playing it ever so often. I don't really shiny hunt or online battle anymore, so Pokemon not even taking... That's fair. Do you, do you like it? I just, like, for me, Pal World is just... I saw popping up and I was just like oh that's a game and I I do see because you know me and I'm uh, obsessed with stuffed animals uh <laughs> I have seen on some of my bootleg websites uh and even eBay because eBay has bootleg sellers all the time um they sell bootleg pal world plushes and also people have made uh crochet patterns for them too I think it's really fun. If you ever have free time, definitely give it a chance. Is it free, or does it cost money? Are you fucking kidding me? I knew it. I knew it. I knew we would get another shiny Bruxish. This is the second shiny Bruxish, by the way. It, fun little fact about me. I hate Bruxish. With all my little heart. This is the second shiny Bruxish I've gotten on this hunt, and I hate Bruxish with all my little heart. Sorry, rant. Kill it, I can't. I I will probably do a giveaway for it at some point. Uh, but, because I'd rather someone else have it if they want it. I don't want to, I hate Bruxish though. It's a third of an AAA game, I think it's closer to, t oh, okay. Hello? Oh, Tiki. Dude, I'm not catching you more than a Pokeball. You're going in a Pokeball. I'll take it. Listen, I'll give it to you. 
this is like one of the only shinies I'm willing to give up. So if you want it, you can have it. I I am such a, a Bruxa shader. I'd rather try not to waste food with everything getting expensive. That's fair. Everything's so expensive nowadays. Thank you, Walking Wake. If you enjoy building houses like in Sims or Minecraft. Oh, I do like that in Minecraft. I love Minecraft. I would love to return to Minecraft. D don't, isn't there like shooting? I hate this shiny. Uh, isn't there like a, um, don't you shoot in that game too? I'm just not good at shooting. <laughs> uh, I've tried. Like I've played Apex. I'm just not good. <laughs> My aim is not, uh, not great. Oh my god! <laughs> huh. Will I ever actually... There we go. Alright. Let me finish this hunt. Yeah, shiny bruxes. Yeah. Let me see how much time I have left. Give me a little bit, and I will trade it to you. Or if you want to trade it now, and you pop up a code, I will give you the code. There is shooting, but the Pokemon help you out, so... <laughs> I also like how you call it Pokemon, because you know that's an, a language I'll understand. <laughs> there are some cute ones, though, that I saw. Some cute, uh, cute little pal world, pal world emons. Also, is it true that Pokemon is suing them? Is Tiki out there? Is Tiki out there? Okay. I thought she was still in here. But, uh... Oh, I guess it is. It's online too, right? Man, these Bruxes... I haven't even gotten another shiny dupiter. I have only gotten on this hunt two shiny bruxish. How vastly unlucky is that, truly? The answer is very. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <sighs> Get in the water, silly. Yeah, Bruxish is my least favorite Pokemon. In case you didn't get that, uh... <laughs> didn't get the memo when I got very angry to get another shiny Bruxish. And I want you guys to know, a little fun fact. I, in total, at this point, have four shiny Bruxish. Not from this hunt, I have two from this hunt. But I have four because I was wonder traded two of them. I heard Pokemon say they're investigating them. Haven't heard of a lawsuit yet, but it's an unbiased party. The closest thing I can see them using as a point is that they're a creature with similar with a very similar polygon size to Primarina on the model snake shape. I don't know what to go after that. I don't Bro, 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 what is going on? I just want a shiny Totodile! <laughs> I'm gonna go crazy. <laughs> this is the third one I've gotten this on. I own five Bruxish. Oh my fuck. I can't. Here's the thing. Like I said, I, if I get any shiny Bruxish, I'll just use them for like a giveaway. Because I just... I'm sure there are people that have to like this Pokemon, right? I'm... I... Ugh. How, uh... How...
weird. How funky. Ah, uh, but yeah, I, I, I thought, I didn't know if they were, I understand the investigation, kind of. I don't know if anything will come from it. A shiny is a shiny. That's what I'm saying. Like, someone's got to at least en enjoy a shiny. Hey, Ostash? Oxdash. Oxdash. How you doing, my friend? Welcome to the stream. I want you to know I'm shiny, uh, hunting for shiny Totodile. Uh, Bruxish is my least favorite Pokemon. I've gotten uh, three shiny Bruxish this hunt. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> how are you doing? How's your, how's your Sunday? <laughs> I hate Bruxish. It always runs into me. It is the only Pokemon in this pond that wants, that is the aggressor. Oh. <laughs> I have a shiny Magikarp and, oh, shiny Magikarp is good though. It's a nice gold. Oh, my first shiny. I like that. My first shiny was in sun and moon and it was Rhyhorn because I was breeding it. Mine's going better than yours apparently. Yeah, apparently. <laughs> Got the, the Blastoise 7th Star Raid cost, so that's nice. Ah, get it done early, yes. Someone yesterday came into stream and was like, Oh yeah, I have to get a... I have to get the... I haven't gotten a Venusaur yet. And I'm like, dude, the Venusaur is over. <laughs> but at least... Like, at least you get it caught. I like the raids because they give herb. That's like the best part about it. So it's like, I can... Man, that crocodile is not having a good time. Like, <laughs> I'm still so gobsmacked about Bruxish. Um, yeah. <laughs> I'm excited for the Charizard one, though. I like these because they give herb, like I said, and as someone who has recently become a shiny hunter, they're very helpful. So, I like them. I was upset when I found out, because I didn't know the Blissey Raids didn't give them. So I was doing a Blissey raid, and I went, where is the herb? Am I just not getting it? And uh, it turns out they just didn't give it at the time, which is very unfortunate. So I just keep doing them for fun. I also think the Blastoise seven star raid is uh, much easier than the Venusaur one. The Venusaur one was killer. Get the total aisle behind you. I don't have decent Pokemon set for Blastoise. I actually into the Charizard raid to see if anyone has any. Ah, uh, that's a good question. I'm gonna have to have another Pokemon too because. Oh, thank you so much for the follow. I'm so happy my sounds are working because that scared me a little. I did a little jump. Um, I don't know what to use yet for Charizard. I've been using Corviknight. Well, I guess I could technically use Corviknight. Technically. But I don't think that's a good idea because it's Charizard. Something with Rain Dance. Maybe a Vaporeon? Vaporeon with. Or, uh, Politoed? Politoed might be good. I don't remember what the, the thing was, though. I only shiny hunt in Pokemon Go. That is fair. I don't blame you. Very exciting to shiny hunt when you find a shiny. Except when it's Bruxish. None of the Pokemon I've trained are useful at all for water or fire types. No, that's fair. I like Corviknight for being a steel type, but I still get- Yeah, that's the thing. What is- is it a- is it a dragon ter- what's its terra type again? And collect Pokemon Go cards? There are Pokemon Go cards? Dragon? I mean... Something with Rain Dance, right? I think would be good. I'm just trying to think. What would be good for... I'm sure that someone will come out with a video soon. But right now, my brain is thinking... Uh... Something with rain dance, As if that's not already obvious. Because <laughs> a lot of... All I'm... My brain is just thinking of things that... Gastrodon? Would Gastrodon be bad? Well, I guess it wouldn't really do much. I've got a Sylveon set up and it'll surely be a batch of other good- Yeah. 
I just, for me, with the seven star raids, I'm not good as being a carry. So I just have a support. I just make sure I don't die and other people don't die. I'm real good at that. If it's dragon, use fairy type. That's fair. I wonder if there are any fairy type though that no rain dance. You know, El Creme might be good. With decorate, and then you can just decorate whoever's next to you. Or near you. That might not be bad. Thinking about it. I'm pretty sure shiny dew fighter's red, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong. But again, uh, no shiny dew fighter. Even though I'm not shiny hunting for it. Could Mew work? see why not because is Mew a little Mew's a little bulkier right or am I just thinking of Pokemon Unite because like something that's kind of like you have a little bulkier and doesn't die in my opinion works at least that's me I I am no by no means a, uh, a Terra raid specialist I am not licensed in that category. I have not earned my PhD. <laughs> I am actually so bad at it that I have to have other people help me. Which isn't a bad thing. I'm not saying it's a bad thing. Um, but sometimes my brain... Uh, how do I explain this? My brain thinks of something and it goes with the first thing it thinks of. It, but it doesn't logically think if it would be good or not. Sometimes I'm just a silly little bean. It has bad stats and can learn any move. Uh, possibly not. I'm not that good either. I just like collecting stuff and starter circle. Yeah. I like it also because, um, for me, with the terror raids, because I breed Pokemon for battling a lot of the time. Um, with the terror raids, they give, they have Pokemon with good IVs. And also the fact that it is starters is kind of fun too. Very fun. I wonder what they're going to do next. Truthfully. I thought that they were at on um, Pokemon Day. I thought they were going to announce like. um, What's it called? I thought they were going to announce like another. Uh, Paradox Pokemon. Like Walking Wake or Iron Leaves. But uh, apparently not. Like the. Uh. I don't have Raging Bolt or whatever the other one was yet, but, you know, I just thought that they would do it just for funsies. Also, how fun is it that, ooh, I, I also used to hate terror raids. I'm not, I'm, I'm gonna, I'll say it. I used to hate terror raids because I thought they were just laggy and that they were awful. And I was like, bring back the Gigantamax raids. I was a hater. But now I enjoy them. I used to hate them. But now I actually know what I'm doing. I'm gonna leave and come back in a minute. Sounds good. I'll be here. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> I should have a lurking emote at some point. But I'm out of emote space. Hmm. Also, caffeine of the day. Monster. Because here's the thing. I like the taste of monster. It's a problem. I got my first ever fortress through a terror raid, so I like- And you know what? That's fair. I just- I didn't like how laggy they are. Don't get me wrong, they're still laggy. <laughs> they're still incredibly laggy. But, um... Now I know what I'm doing. So I'm really- I, I'm not mad at them anymore. But I was a really big fan of Gigantamaxing and Dynamax raids. So my heart was sad. I still- Terras are okay. I don't mind Terras. I am vastly excited, though, that Megas are coming back. You know? I- I don't- Terras are okay. I don't mind Terras. I did really love Gigantamax and Dy Dynamax. I was really a fan of those. And I might be the only person that says that. 
I never really beat Sword and Shield after getting a Pokemon I wanted, so I never did the raids. That's fair. I really liked... I put a lot of time into Sword and Shield. A lot of time. Um... Just because I was... I mean, at the time, I was streaming, and then I had to take a break from streaming because I was moving home from college. And it was, it was just a... I, I loved breeding in Sword and Shield. I don't like breeding... I hate Bruxish. I don't like breeding so much in this game either, but it is what it is now, I guess. I could finish the battles without Dynamaxing, so I said, yeah, and you know what? That's fair. I could too. That's how I feel about Terra's, though, is that I can I can finish a battle without Terra typing. Sometimes I forget Terra typing is even a thing, which is fine. But it's a... Uh, you know, bro, there's a, a Bruxish coming right at me. Are you going to defend your trainer? Thank you. I just, you know, and maybe Dynamaxing wasn't for everyone, and that's fair. I get it. But Terra Typing's not for me. But Mega's coming back is pretty rad. That was another reason I had to take a break from this game, was uh, the breeding. Because, like I said, I'd try and breed Pokemon for a... Uh, for competitive uh, battling. And I finally come to terms with it. And I understand the sandwiches. I thought the sandwiches were silly. But now I really love this game. I also did not. It was not it. I was attached to this story so much more than I was Sword and Shield. But Sword and Shield does have a soft spot in my heart. Although I will say, Sun and Moon also has a soft spot in my heart. A lot of them, a lot of the games do, truly. But they all have different soft spots. Ooh, gotta take a sippy. I also have to make sure I'm kind of maintaining okay posture. Cause I don't want my back to die. You know, again, I, I still find it amazing that I don't, uh, haven't found a shiny dewpiter. Sun and Moon is really fun for me. It was a colossal pain. I love Sun and Moon with all my little heart. I love the Alolan forms. And that is what truly got me into VGC for realsies. Like, X and Y started it, and then Sun and Moon made it grow. Uh, Sun and Moon 2, though, I... Or Ultra Sun and Moon. Uh, they definitely should not have made the whole game over. But I still really enjoy the game a lot. It's fun. I loved just... I love the characters. And the anime was also good. It was just... I just really liked it a lot. But I know that some people didn't like it because it was certainly a change from uh, the traditional Pokemon type, like gyms and stuff. But I didn't really, I didn't really care. I think change can be a good thing. Sometimes, you know, you might not like it, but I think that overall it helps the game adapt and be better. Yes, Walking Wake, take out all the Bruxish. It's, I still find it vastly amazing that I have yet to find a shiny Totodile. Sun and Moon is also very easy for shiny hunting with the SOS method. I would get accidental shinies all the time. Also, my first shiny in this game was an accidental Palmy. Palmo. Palmy. Because I saw I was playing through the game. And, uh, I was like, sick. Pomo. And then I saw the shiny, and I was like, oh, no, 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 no. Because it's pink, so you can absolutely see it. Thought I heard a cat. I was wrong. Although I wouldn't be shocked if Tiki would just magically get on my chair. Yes, die, little Bruxish. I also have to sometimes, like, put my, like, sit up 
because I can't see the color changes, even though I should with Totodile. I don't understand how I'm having one tough hunt from to another tough hunt. My last hunt, my last shiny hunt was uh, Vulpix. And uh, that was a colossal pain, to say the least. I had used 10 shiny sandwiches and it took me the course of three days. This is technically day three of shiny hunting for Totodile. But I thought that this would be easier. But no, shiny sandwich six, three bucks six bucks ish later. I just <laughs> Totodile, do me a favor, send this message to the rest of you that spawn and just give me a shiny, please. Thank you. You think he's gonna relay the message? I hope so. Totodile's I, I've come to conclude as my third favorite starter. My first one is Cyndaquil. Second is Bulbasaur. Third is Totodile. He's moved up the ranks. A lot. From what he was at. And I would love a shiny one. Because I do have- I already have shiny, um... I already have shiny Cyndaquil. You're back! Welcome back, friend! No shiny Totodile yet, as you can see. Still trying so hard. Syndical gang, hell yeah. People look at me and be like, really, Syndical? Like, hello? Syndical's so good. I have like a shrine to Syndical in this room too. It's just a good Pokemon. And Bulbasaur is good. Totodile's good. I do have some un some overrated uh, starter opinions, though. I will say. I think Torchic is a little overrated. I'm sorry, that's just my opinion. I don't think Torchic's a bad Pokemon. But, but, I think it's overrated. And we all know Charmander's overrated with like Charizard. Fully, fully overrated. That, that's my opinion. That meme is me right now. Try <laughs> not me starting fights with the Pokemon community. Uh L opinion plus ratio. Listen. It's just it's so overrated. He's just a little she's a happy little chicken. I got nothing against him, but he's a little overrated. Just like Charmander at this point. Oh, the shiny sandwich went out. Okay, time for another little raid. Hi, Totodile. You're not shiny. Okay, another raid. Oh, look, a Chansey. Like I said, nothing against it. I just see too many... Too many Blazikens. And with the overrated Mon, I'm going to give a random underrated Mon. And that Mon is Raichu. Compared to Pikachu and Pichu, it's very underrated. Fancy awards. Is there a award show tonight? Apparently. Okay. Hey, oh. Yeah, I know I won't be able to catch it. It's fine. Carbonite. What did I do? Did I press B on accident? I must have. Oh, someone did Mew. 
Someone's name is Fist Me Daddy. How lovely. Hmm. Granola bar. It's like, oh, this one goes as easy as the last one. Sorry, it's chewing on my wonderful granola bar. I think my goal in life is to have a monster sponsor me. Truly. I just love the taste of it. I don't know why. Couldn't tell you. Oh. Kelly's doing a lot of damage. <coughs> and then after this, we'll be doing shiny sandwich number seven. Seven. Man, the only one who's really doing damage is a galley. <laughs> roost after this next one. I didn't even see my health. Huh. Raid to my right. Actually, just body press. Looks like it didn't do a lot of damage anyway. And then one more body press and then it's a week. Oh, I guess I could have screeched. Shell smash. That's terrifying to see. It's also snowing. Can we just talk about that? So sick of snow. I didn't even see what happened there. Screech! So he's avoided the attack. Rude. Yeah, this raid is so much easier than Venusaurus. Not the rain dance. Someone sunny day. Try this again. There we go. All right, let's see what kind of herb we'll get. Blastoise. Sweet! Get it? Because it's sweet herb. But it sounded like I was saying, oh, sweet. <laughs> Sorry, I'll stop. <laughs> Code, I love your little frog. It's really cute. Alright. Time for a nice, sweet sandwich. I guess the question is, will we get another shiny Bruxish before we get a goddamn... 
cucumber, green, red, yellow, prosciutto, sweet, boom, silver pick. Uh, I feel like I've made this sandwich so many times. Because <laughs> I have. This is time. Is this seven? Right? Seven? Yeah, it's seven. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. Oh. The question is after the shiny hunt, do I go for Rowlet? Do I go for. Well, Rowlet, Bulbasaur, could also go for like Flygon, technically speaking. Oh dear, this is getting, oh, come on. Uh, uh, uh. Perfectly made half Sammy. Oh, gracious me. Alright, back to the old grind. Yeah, I have the nice sweet sandwich. This is- I have the Spatsumaru on my desk to say what mood I'm in. It has this one, and then, uh, this one. But I think the mood I'm in is this one, because of the uh, shiny hunt. Just so we're all aware. Oh my goodness, sparkling level three. My happy little shiny whimsicott. All right, there we go. I almost went into the water without my Pokemon. Also, I love Maridon so much because it makes me so much faster and I just, like the bike is fine. The regular, like, bike. But having a Maridon is so much better. Bro! Alright. Get him. I haven't seen a Totodile yet. But that's fine. I'll take out all the Pokemon along the way. So that then we can spawn some friendly, good old fashioned Tudodile. <sighs> you know. I also want to say I tried to play uh, Pokemon Unite the other day. I got very angry very fast. Because the, the rank resets as it does, right? And I play Cinderace. Although I, I can play other characters, I just prefer Cinderace. And I have to say, I hate the in-game chat. And by in-game chat, I mean the voices. Because I hate having hearing people be mean to others. Like, if it were something that'd be, like, good, right? But a majority of the time, it's, like, not good. Just mean. Not even- I say mean, but, like- Mean sounds so juvenile. It's just so rude. Like, borderline, just like non sympathetic words that they're just using to hurt someone else. It's just, it's. Uh, it's the one reason I don't like MOBA games. Is people just want to be dicks for no reason. And I feel like, you know, you, you should have a reason to be a dick. Not a just randomly being one. Like this Bruxish. He doesn't have a reason to be a dick, but he's being one anyway. Uh, it's fine. What the heck is that? I was so confused because I saw the Dewpiter in front of the Bruxish, and I was like, I was, I was like, hello? What the fuck is that? I love that I have Walking Wake for this too. Because he can just beat up the underground Pokemon. And I think that's beautiful. I also have to level up my Deerling. To be able to get it battle ready for Colin today. Not that I think... Not that I'm battling Colin today. Because... 
but just in case. Whenever Colin comes in. Because I have to have Bruxish. Er. Bruxish on the mind, apparently. Get him. Yeah. I am so sick of looking at shiny Bruxish. I have four shiny Bruxish. Four. Four, not one, not two, not three, fucking four. Why do I jinx myself? I jinx myself every time. I just gotta stop. I'm so sick of it. <laughs> oh my fuck. I'm not even a shiny dew piter. No, no shiny dewpiter. Only shiny Bruxish for you. You want your hunting for shiny totodile? Sorry, bitch. Can't. That is what life is telling me right now. Oh my. Good lord. If, if there is no one in the world that hates shiny Bruxish, then I am dead. That is how you know I am dead. Just saying. Because as long as I'm alive, this Pokemon will be the bane of my existence. Totodile, please. I just want to end it. I want to end the hunt. God forbid. Oh, gonna have a heart attack. I just don't get it, man. I don't like the mon. Thank you. Beat up the Totodile. Beat up everyone. I just want shiny Totodile. I, like, I mentally am just so detached right now. Totodile, please come up. Thank you. Wait, oh, Mr. Wake. Mr. Walking Wake for helping me in this time. I've killed so many Bruxish. I've destroyed their lives, their families. And they still keep and and i just want to say i've only been streaming for an hour and i've gotten three shiny bruxish okay i guess i gotta stop talking about it i gotta stop talking because another one's gonna appear and i'm gonna lose my fucking mind all right it's fine it's fine is that what i think it is it's not Oh boy, golly. You know, you all know what I miss from Nintendo? I miss DS's. I play on my DS, or Dakota plays on my DS. Like, it's not like my DS is not being played, right? <laughs> but I miss the, the flip. I don't bring my Switch anywhere because it makes me nervous that, like, something's going to happen to the screen because there's nothing protecting it. But I miss, like, the convenience of, a uh, of a, uh, what's it called? Of a DS or a Game Boy. I miss that luxury. Sad days. DS is better. I agree. Like, I like the Switch, don't get me wrong. But, uh, 
like ha just it's so different from having a DS in your hand from having a switch it's so vastly different like and a DS could like fit in your pocket right or a Game Boy like just the convenience of it did Totoro just fall off the he sure did I just wanted to battle the Toto. Google alert. Web e cycle. Oh. Not something I really care about. I thought it might something was being hacked. I wonder if what the Switch 2 is gonna be different than the regular Switch. Because that's common, right? I mean, Pokemon uh, Z to A is going to be on the Switch. So we clearly have another year of Switch. But I want Switch the Switch, if they make the Switch 2 or the second Switch, I want them to make uh, it just a bit more convenient to carry around. And I know they sell the carrying cases, and that's fine. But a homie just wants to... You know, have convenience. Am I a fan of Digimon? Uh, yeah. I I was watching the uh, Digimon anime not too long, maybe like a year ago. I was trying to watch it. I, I <laughs> when I was a kid, there was one book I always wanted from the library, and it was a uh, Digimon. Can you find this Digimon bo uh, book? Like, look, can you find it? It was my favorite one. Uh, my favorite Digimon is Paimon, which is not shocking. I also like Gabumon, though, a lot. I think that they're very good, both of them. But I, I am a fan, but... My knowledge in it is very little. And, like I said, I was watching the show not too long, like, within the last, like, three years. I was just trying to watch it to get into it. And, don't get me wrong, it was okay. But it wasn't, like, I could watch Pokemon for hours on it. Just in the background. But, for whatever reason, I couldn't really do that with Digimon. But I, I do like I like the designs a lot of the uh, of Digimon, like Digimon Digital Monsters. Da, 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 da. That definitely had a big impact on my childhood, though. Just like I was a fan of uh, Yu-Gi-Oh, Yu-Gi-Oh, and I've never played the Yu-Gi-Oh card game, but I collected those cards like a mother. I will say. I watched the, because there was the one Yu-Gi-Oh! movie that came out, right? In theaters. I don't remember what it was called, but it was a Yu-Gi-Oh! movie. And when you went there, you got a pack of cards. I saw that movie probably seven times, because I wanted the cards so bad, and I really wanted the Blue Eyes White Dragon. I wanted a bunch of the Blue Eyes White Dragon. So, I went there a lot. A lot. And I watched it. And I liked, I loved Yu-Gi-Oh so much. That's why, that's one of the reasons why uh, my cat's name is Kribo. Because Kribo is a fuzzy little Yu-Gi-Oh creature. I also liked Bakugan. Again, never played the game of Bakuman, Bakugan. But I did collect the little figures, for sure. The little uh, balls that... When are attached to a magnet, they turn into a little creature. I really liked Bakugan too. I remember when I was watching the show and I was like, man, I wish this was a toy. And then we went to Target, my grandmother, me, and my stepbrother. Because we were looking for things that we might want for our birthday. Because our birthday, my, his was in September, mine was in July. So typically our birthday parties would be together. And we were just looking for things so my grandmother could take note. And I saw this 
uh, I saw this set of them, and it had one of the, I forgot what the name of it is, but it was like the, the dragon one, one of the main characters has it, but it was like this really pretty teal, and I was like, I want this, and I specifically want that one. My grandmother was like, well, you're not getting it until your birthday, and I was like, that's fine, I want it so bad. So, and I still have it to this day. My grandmother still has a lot of my old toys, which is very nostalgic for me. Loved Bakugan with all my little heart. And then we would always trade Bakugan, right? In school. And uh, then they got banned. Why did they get banned, you asked? Because people are making unfair trades. Which is true. I once got a, an unfair trade back when I was in... This was an elementary school, right? And you had to pretend to be going to your backpack to get like a notebook or a pencil or something. And uh, this kid at the time, he was like, hey, do you want to trade for this uh, Bakugan? And I was like, oh yeah, absolutely. Because I was in elementary school, and I had a crush on this kid, right? And, uh, so I was like, oh yeah, that'd be sick. So we did our secret little trade, like we were smuggling drugs to each other in the fifth grade or something. And, um, or maybe it was fourth grade, one of the two. But, uh, he gave me the not a duplicate that I already had, but I didn't say anything at the time. Because I was like, he's gonna not like me if I call him out. So, uh, I didn't say anything. And that's, uh... When I was a child, I was a huge pushover. Am I still a huge pushover? Yes. But that's why I'm in therapy. But yeah. And then Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Well, Yu-Gi-Oh cards weren't banned in elementary. Or maybe they were. Because kids would play all the time. But the kids would play, like, during lunch and during, uh, like, study hall or whatever. Or, I guess not study hall, in elementary school. They'd play, like, during lunch or recess. And I don't remember why exactly they got banned in elementary school. But they got... Yu-Gi-Oh! got banned from my high school because it was making a huge comeback. And for whatever reason, they didn't want kids playing Yu-Gi-Oh! Because I don't know if kids were making bets... Like, kind of gambling with it a little bit. But, um... You know, uh, that's why it was banned from my school. Because people were, I guess, betting money on Yu-Gi-Oh cards. So they had to play Yu-Gi-Oh in secret in high school. I didn't have that problem because I had my sweet little Pikachu 3DS. And I would play Pokemon during lunch. I would carry it around with me in my backpack, and that's just what I would do during lunch. And everyone was like, yeah, that's Taylor, that that fits. But... <laughs> I still find it hilarious they banned Bakugan for kids, and we had to smuggle it like drugs near our backpack. Just so stupid. But yeah, that, that was my, those are things that were banned in my childhood. Did you guys have anything that was, uh, randomly banned from your school? Because it was, like, quote-unquote causing problems? That were just, like, kids' toys or whatever? I don't think there were any other ones other than, well, I guess they did ban Pokemon cards, too. But people in my school banned, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh!, my school banned Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh cards because people would get their cards stolen. Yeah, I can see that. Pokemon cards, yeah. I just... Kids were ruthless back in the day, man. I just... I don't... Kids are weird. But now, like, that's like the least of school's problems with kids now, right? Like, banning Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh cards? Like, no, you have to make sure that they don't have their phone and doing a TikTok dance in a bathroom. Or that they're stealing cars. Like, they thought we were... Whew. 
and shenanigans. Wrong. Kids are stealing cars. Doing dumb stuff to get them killed. Tide Pod Challenge. Just insane. People vaping. Exactly. But no, Pokemon cards and Yu-Gi-Oh cards were the problem. Vaping wasn't really a big big thing back in the day for for me. But like, I mean, nah, not really. It really kind of boomed uh when I got out of, when I was in college, I would say. When I was just starting college and high school. My dad had a little vape, but my dad also was always trying to quit smoking at the time. So that's the only reason. Because he called it, it was a, a, a water vape, I guess his specifically was. Or, or something of the sort. But uh, he had a, a little special vape because he was trying to quit smoking. That's the only reason I knew about vapes at the time. And then, he also had a Jewel, I believe, when Jewels came out. He was really trying to kick it. Never did, but... That was just how I found out. And then, like, everyone had them. I will say, I never had a Jewel. I also, a majority of my life, though, was a goody two-shoes, so... Not that I'm not a goody two-shoes now. But. I, uh. I used to be very. <laughs> just yikes. <laughs> Thinking about it. Um. Uh, as a child. But here I am now. Playing Pokemon. Being angry about getting a shiny fish four times. When all I want is a shiny crocodile. Oh, how we evolve. <laughs> Uh, yeah. There was also a time, right, and, uh, in school that I remember, where there was a huge fight. I didn't witness very many fights, because they just would happen in the hallway when I was in class or whatever. And, uh, there was a time- I like how he's just walking across the floor, this Totodile. Uh, there was a time where we were all in the cafeteria, like it was a senior's lunch type deal. All the seniors had lunch at the same time. And all of a sudden, this brawl broke out. And everyone's standing up trying to look. It was at, like, the opposite side of where I was. Uh, but this fight was between a freshman who is... Freshmen are typically, around this time, about 14, 15, 13, right? And uh, it was between a grown adult, 20, 20... One year old who snuck into the school because his girlfriend at the time who was a 14-year-old girl, let him in. And, uh, I guess because the one kid was talking smack about her, uh, the boyfriend went to go beat him up. You got in a fight? Listen. What was the fight about, and did you win? I don't condone fighting, but now you've piqued my curiosity. <laughs> I've never been in a school fight. I've only been in hockey fights. And that's not me trying to flex. I'm just saying. Those are the only types of fights I've actually been in. But I know if I was in an actual fight with my adrenaline kicking, I would kick ass. No, oh, no actual fight. I'm trying to think back. No, no. Not in school, not in... Just arguments. I was an arguer. He kicked me... So I kicked him, and we both got a Saturday, like a Saturday detention. Why did he kick you? Do kids just like to kick nowadays? Does it take that little? Oh, but yeah, so the 21-year-old... The I don't know, that's fair. There was a, uh... Oh, with the 21-year-old, he had, like, snuck into the school. And I think that was, like, the school's way of being, like, wow, our security really isn't that good. Which was, uh, unfortunate, I guess. Because <laughs> he just kind of came in and started fighting the 14-year-old. I don't know if he was arrested or anything. 
but uh you know uh you know if you're a 21 year old and you're fighting a 14 year old i guess to me that's kind of uh bro i can't i can't i can't i can't i can't i can't ah <sighs> Anyway, I'm just not going to give it any attention. I don't know. Fights are... I don't even know what would get me to be in a fight. Like, you'd have to get me really, really angry. And I'm not going to lie, I don't really get super angry. I mean, I get mad at, like, Pokemon Unite. Don't get me wrong. Um, but, like, at a person? I don't think I get super... I'm a pretty calm and chill person, I would say. I'm just a calm little... Calm little fella, I guess. <laughs> Like, if someone's- if two people are mad, I try and go to both people and I'm like, Hey, what's the problem? How can we resolve this? I've always been a problem solver. Don't know why. But. The only problems you can't really problem solve are in hockey. But it's entertaining for everyone. Like, fighting? Depends on who's fighting, because- if it's like a family thing, right? Like, that's not great. Like, the fights in school might be entertaining for people, yeah, but. I don't know. Like I said, I've never been. Oh my god, D, guess what? Guess how many. I want you to make a numerical guess as to how many shiny Bruxish I have gotten today. I want you to make a numerical guess. Six. Uh, close. Four? So I now have five shiny Bruxish, because I got one yesterday. And let me tell you, it's not been a good time. Like, I understand, right? Like, it's, you know, you're shiny hunting for Pokemon. You're gonna get other Pokemon, right? You are. Not a shiny Dewpiter. They do love me, and I don't fucking know why, because I want to take it out of the water and smack it on the ground. I just beat Tatsugiri. Tatsugiri is a good mon. They just came out, the Pokemon Center just came out with a bunch of Tatsugiri plushes, too. So, and keychains. And all that jazz. I saw Uh, this game makes me grumpy. It's fine. It's fine. Shiny Totodile will come, right? This is only Shiny Sandwich number 7. How could I expect it to come after Shiny Sandwich number 7? How could I expect that? <coughs> I don't know. Eventually. That's a, that's a good word for it. Eventually. Nothing less than disappointing. I have to cough. <coughs> Excuse me. Nah. I don't know why, but this morning, like, I, I just felt very stuffed up. Like, I'm feeling fine now, but... Very weird. Probably the weather, because it's fucking snowing. After it was 70 degrees last week. I'm very bitter at the weather. I don't know if you can tell. Granted, I do like colder weather. I hate hot weather. But, I just want a little bit of sunshine. A little bit of fun. So sad. True, that is, that is me right now. I am the sad. And once this hunt is over, 
and we get Shiny Totodile, you will see me be the happiest little bean you've ever seen. And we're gonna get some ditto hypes in the chat. Ugh. Fall is best. Hard agree. I love autumn. I love fall. I am a Halloweeny beanie, okay? Halloween's the best. And I live my life very Halloween every day. I love the crisp sound of leaves falling under and then you step on them with your boots. Ugh. I also like spring though. As long as it's not too hot. I like spring. Because spring is just starting to get... It's not hot yet. And you get to see flowers bloom. And it's just very... A pretty time. So spring and fall, I definitely like... I would say I like fall, then spring, and then winter or summer, like a colorful, yeah, exactly. Sometimes I just need a little, little bit of color to up my mood, you know? That's just me. I'm a big fan of bright, fun colors and springtime things. Like, for whatever reason, I'm obsessed with frogs right now, and frogs are just, they're, they're a springtime animal. How fun. Look at it. Yay. More beating up of Pokemon. Ooh. Yeah, spring is spring is just a fun time. Walking Wake does not want to take out the Dewpiters. Ooh, my back. Stretch! Ah. If you haven't stretched yet, make sure you stretch. Oh boy. I know what Shiny Totodile looks like. He's green. <coughs> <coughs> oh my god, what is wrong with me today? <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Ow. Hmm. Looks like I have something stuck in my throat. Drink more water. Excuse me. Oh my goodness. Oh, that was shiny sandwich number seven. Now we're on shiny sandwich number eight. We gotta get some herb. Golly gee. We're rolling up the sleeves. We're getting serious. The, the scrunchie, it's going on the phone. Boop. All right. Let's get serious. Stretching the wrist. Is Tiki out there? I don't know. I don't know where Tiki went. She was at one point near here. Ah. Oh. All right, I'm gonna stretch back. <sighs> Very exciting. Yay! Okay. Changing the Pokemon to Corviknight. This is gonna give us an herb that will be on Shiny Sandwich number 8. Beautiful time. I hope this person is not going Skeldurge. Because that would be vastly unlucky. Yeah, I guess Claude Sire is fine. Right? I'm say why not. Please don't abandon the raid. There. Yes. A poison ground. Yeah, it should be fine. Or, well, that's ground. See, my mind thought of poison, so that's why I was like, yeah, it's fine. Let's hope it doesn't get hit with a bunch of hydro pumps, huh? I also enjoy myself a good Claude Sire. Oh, a shiny Lucario. 
How much you want to bet that's the one he got from the uh, the give giveaway? Is that what they call it? The the, the Pokemon gifts. Pokemon gift. That's the word. <clears throat> All right. Let's start off with a cheer. All right. We cheered. Who's it hitting? Okay, not me. Sick. Very, very cool. For a sphere. That's a little chunk. Yeah, Corviknight's fine. As long as I tank, gift. Yeah, true. That's the right name. Because Lucario had died. Hydro pump, woo! Don't worry guys, I'll tank. It's fine, just keep attacking him and I'm just gonna keep living. Why, he keeps hitting me. That's fine, well never mind. he did hit Lucario. I don't know about this one, boys. <laughs> well, maybe it'll be fine. Living is overrated. You know, sometimes, but it's good to live. You know, a lot of the time. Life is worth it, I would say. In, in game, though, is living overrated? Maybe perhaps a little bit. Okay, I'll do a go all out. Mudshot did not do much. I guess I'll start actually hitting it now. Never mind, I'm gonna roost one more time. Someone critical hit someone. And I, I, I can't even tell what it was. All right, time for a screech. So many screeches, it hurts. Yep, then negate all negative things from yourself. Yep. Mm-hmm. Nice. Screech. Alright, gang, get him. Yeah. Another screech. Oh my god! Guys, hit him. Jeez Louise! You're killing me, guys. Oh, he died too. Go, Corviknight. No, who died? Damn it. Alright, we gotta try again. Because, God forbid. I'm gonna put emotes in the chat. First, sad. This is, this is me right now. All of these are me. It is fine. Yeah, that too. I love how they bounce around. It's so cute. I love my little emote wall.
but so people feel like they're heard, you know? All right, another one. Well, I know that wasn't my fault. I wasn't the one that kept dying. Lucario is just a little too not bulky, to say the least. A little too not bulky. And that's okay. Kind of. Oh boy. Come on, let me in! Let me in! I just want an herb. Just give me an herb. Please. Please. Herb. I know it'll let me in. It's just going to take a minute. <laughs> and that's on being delusional, I guess. <laughs> the way it just went. Haha, <laughs> no. Jeez, Louise. Uh, Blastoise, please. I just need one herb and then I can continue my quest for the Toad and Isle. That's all I want. Please. I know I can get into your raid because a million people are doing them probably right now. Come on. I believe in you. Please. Oh, thank God. I <laughs> huh. I am the definition of, I am the definition of disparage at the moment. Unbelievable. Ears itchy. Let me in. Let me defeat it. Let me get shiny totodile. And then I'll be free. I just want to be free. And then I can shiny hunt something else. Can't even check for new postings, because are you letting me into a Blastoise raid? Or are you going to say, oh no, sorry, cannot connect? That's one of my gripes with this game. Is, uh, oh wow, look at that. Uh, is the connecting and the. But I understand it's also like Wi Fi and stuff. I get it. Did that guy have a totodile? Of course he does. It's just mocking me at this point. Strictly mocking me. Timmy. This guy just... Well, I guess Arian is fine. Ah! Timmy's switching off his totodile. Imagine if it was a shiny totodile. That for sure was made to mock me, though. I don't think Walking Wake is bad for this, also. Because you could just flamethrower. And especially if uh, Vaporeon has Sunny Day, right? Should. Oh, never mind. We decided to go in a completely different direction. Another different direction. Okay. Guy's name is Na Rachi. Pikachu is my favorite Pokemon. Good. I'm glad you like Pikachu. I enjoy Pikachu too. I like I've said before, I have so many Pikachu plushes I could probably drown in them. Truly. Let's see if I can read this guy's name properly. His name is Narachika. 
Not a chica. Okay. I think that's a raw. Chica. I'm reading the, the Japanese name, by the way. Because... Haha. <laughs> I'm duolingoing Japanese. And I also, uh... Did Japanese in college. For two years. I cannot... And I Duolingo every day. I'm at like 205 or something, I think. For my Duolingo. I personally think it's fun. Your itch. Ah, ha, 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 your itch. Why are my ears so itchy? This also seems like it's gonna be a long, another long raid. Someone is already terrotyping? Who is it? Oh, Horiyama? Are you gonna do a lot of damage? Nice. Okay, not bad. I'm at the 210 streak for Spanish and French. Proud of you. I, I, I'm on... Am I on 205? Yeah, 205 sounds about right. I enjoy my, uh, my Japanese. It certainly can be tough, though, because reading hiragana, katagana, and kanji is a toughie. My friend got two got to 2,000 then forgot? How do you forget after 2,000 days? That's so many days. I love Duolingo. It's like, the best part about it, right, is the, the marketing. And by that, I mean like, Duolingo on social media is like the funniest thing ever and I want to one day be able to run a social media like that just so unhinged and fun I what is happening why did we all why did you guys all pass away super effective shouldn't be I'm gonna roost again, because I don't want to die. No! Oh! Nice. I'm gonna roost on this bar. Yeah, that was a good idea by me. Predicting all that good jazz. Alright, I guess I will... But your thing hasn't even broken yet. Why are you shell smashing? What is occurring? Uh, body press, I guess? Bullet punch. Okay, I will body press. I need someone else to whack him. I will heal up cheer. Because I don't want to die. I don't I think this one's a loss too. God damn it. An unfortunate set of circumstances. <sighs> we tried. I think the healed one was probably the better one than, uh... Yep, good night. What is freaking going on? Yeah, yeah. You're a tough Blastoise, we get it. Blast this out of your cave.
fine. I mean, it's not, but it is. Am I better? Of course. <laughs> oh. I just want an herb. Just one. Could go Corviknight. For the Corviknight raid. Come on, get me in. Always true. Skittles. Sour Skittles. Currently what I'm munching on at the moment. I'm a big fan of sour candy. Of course I wasn't. Let's try again. Come on. Let me in. Bro. Gotta wait for the check new postings, I guess. Because I know the minute that I try to do it, it's just gonna say check for new post tanks. Gotta go running some errands and grabbing coffee. Come before work. Thank you. I shall text you. Man, is it just not? Oh, there it is. Let me in. Now, oh, Swallow. We could have done a Swallow raid. I do, in fact, enjoy my Swallow. Touch my back. Oof. Is it not gonna let me into this one either? Yeah, see, this is why I don't like the raids as much as I could. What? Find our own blasters raid. I know you're here somewhere. There you are. Jesus, I gotta walk all the way from here. It's fine. JJ, thanks for- Oh, look how cute emotes! Welcome to the stream! I love the em- oh, The Among Us. They're amazing. I will always remain a really big fan of Among Us. No matter what anyone says. Jesus, they're all just congregating. Gotta suss them all. Yeah. I hard agree. I still watch... Whenever I, like, eat food and I need something on in the background, I will always put on... Uh... Among Us videos. I was such a big fan. Still am. But Among Us kind of, like, fell off. But I still... Enjoy. Hi! Hi! How are you doing on this lovely little Sunday? 
currently I need to do another Blastoise raid to get herb. Because, uh, you know, for shiny Bruxish. And I hate Bruxish. So it's just a rather unfortunate time. But we're going to turn that unfortunate time into a fortunate time. Alright. I understand. Let anyone join. It's fine. We're gonna turn this into a good... We're gonna get Totodile. We are. I know we are. It's gonna happen. I haven't seen anyone bring an eye ape yet. So this might be interesting. Unfortunate time to fortunate crime. Yes. Wholeheartedly agree. <laughs> I don't even, I'm not even like 100% sure what that means, but yes. Fortunate crime. What qualifies as a fortunate crime? That a cat? No. I think there's still a cat in my closet. But I can't... I'm not 100% sure. I saw the clothes in my closet moving. And that's how you just kind of know. But as for like... <laughs> I haven't seen it. I haven't seen the a cat. In quite a little bit. All right, let's see if we can beat this one. Third time's the charm, right? Right. <laughs> Don't worry, Blastoise cannot eat the berries that it does not have. I also really want the, uh, if, I don't know if you guys follow Pokemon merch stuff, but I really want the, uh, the Pomo huggy guy. Like, they have, like, the long arms so that they can hug you. And I really want it so it can, like, go right here. This is a Minecraft bee. But I really want that. Eventually. I guess I'll body press. Yeah. Quack. I'll be the first one to hit you. I'm not afraid. Uh, I guess I'll do it again. Everyone's calm mining. Whack. Uh, I'm gonna do a... No, I'll wait. I'll just do another body press, I guess. Do I collect anime figures? <sighs> yes! Dakota and I have a little collection. Um, currently, I mean, he has more than I do. Uh, this is, I can show you some that are on my desk. I only have, I have, uh, right now on my desk, I have, uh, Inosuke from Demon Slayer as a lookup figure. And then I also have, uh, two little Gojos. Here's one Gojo. And I'll show you the second Gojo second gojo i am a big fan of jujitsu kaisen big fan dakota for christmas i got him so many anime figures what did i get him i got him gato nanami uh sakuna did i say gojo already because i did get him gojo and I got him a Overlord figure as well. Or no, that was for, no, yes. I got him Overlord and I got him uh, Assassination Classroom. Because we watch Assassination Classroom together and that show is <coughs> Chef Kiss. Oh, I love those. I still have to watch the entirety of Sailor Moon. 
Because I've seen, like, some episodes, but not, like, a, a super duper ton. Oh, I didn't do it in time. But I do want to watch it. But I know that it's confusing to me, because is Sailor Moon Crystal, is that what the old anime used to be? Like, is it, like, just recolored? Or not recolored, like reanimated, I guess is the question. Because I'll watch Sailor Moon Crystal, or do I have to go back all the way to the OG? You know what I mean? You see where my confusion lies a little bit? Because I'll watch Sailor Moon Crystal. I mean, I'll watch the other one too, but I just... I, I know that Sailor Moon Crystal came out more recently. So that is where my, uh... Confusion is. And I've seen different things online. And they all confused me. So I was like, oh, okay. And I just never... Never did. Because it intimidated me. A little bit. Just a little bit. Sailor Moon's good, though. I already know Sailor Moon's pretty solid. Nice. Nice, Corviknight. Good job. I'm gonna do a... S uh, oh. Now I can screech. Alright, alright, alright. Now I have to, yep, attack. I'm gonna up our defense so that we can live a little. You know? Okay, now I will screech to help out Annihilate. Yeah, Corvanoid! Surf. Screech. Ah. Uh, okay. Do sunny day again, please. This is making me nervous. Roost. No. Damn it. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. We've got this. I also have Sado Kaiba, Cordicopter Sakura, Clear Card. Ooh! Oh, yeah! Sometimes I forget about No Game, No Life's Existence, but that is also a very good anime, huh? I did watch that. I have to watch, um. I watched, like, the first two seasons of How to Pick Up Girls in a Dungeon. But I have to rewatch it because I know season five's coming out, and that's insane to me. I also have to watch. What else do I have to watch? Um, the Devil's a Part Timer. I have to rewatch it so that I can follow in. Currently, I am watching. Please. I've got to go? That's okay. Thanks for staying around as long as you did, friend. Bye. Have a good day. But, um... I... Oh, I'm currently watching Haiku uh, with Dakota. I'm watching Bungo Stray Dogs and Blue Lock. Blue Lock is a soccer anime. Haiku is a volley... Oh my god, it didn't even give me one. Haiku's a volleyball anime. And... Bunko Stray Dogs is hard to uh, explain. Detectives, powers... Fun. That's about the only way I can explain it. Without giving things away.
Is it because it was my raid? Is that why? Is, is the game just angry that I keep asking for herbs? And they're like, we're not going to give you any. We'll let you into a raid, but no. Hello! I got two blue eyes white dragon statues. Oh, from first four figures. That's so cool. Blue eyes white dragon is so iconic, man. It's so good. Oh my god, of course I wasn't able to join. Blue eyes white dragon is very good. Ugh. I'm feeling so nostalgic now. I had like a... It was like a cool puzzle thing that I made a statue of. I think it was the magician. I forgot what it's called. But... It was something something ma magician. I'm gonna look it up. Magician... Yu-Gi-Oh. Dark Magician. Also, I looked up Magician, and then Pokemon came up as a thing, so I'm just gonna... Oh, Magician's ability. Okay, an ability. <laughs> uh, yes, I understand. Hold on, I gotta get my... My stuff is all kerfuffled. Oh boy. Okay, there we go. If I'm honest, Blue Eyes is my favorite deck to play. I don't blame you. Because it sounds like fun. 100%. And it's iconic. Ah, oh, I miss Yu-Gi-Oh. The days of Yu-Gi-Oh. The days of when things were so simple. Of what, what Yu-Gi-Oh card pack am I going to pick? And what is it going to have in it? Now I have things like bills and taxes and a job, and I feel too adult for my own good. Too adult for my own good. Bring me back to those days. Be up till 4 a.m. playing games like Minecraft. Being so excited to go to <laughs> Uh, it's sad that some of the cards are so expensive. Yeah, and then people like buy them all and they scalp them, so then they're more expensive than they originally were. It's just, it's dis it's all disappointing. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll roost. Oh my god, is he dead already? Yeah, it's- I wish all cards were just, like... What's the word? Um... I wish they were all... Oh my god, I can't think of the word. Uh, not manageable. Like, everyone could get, like, an equal... chance to get them. That they were more, uh... Accessible. Accessible is the word. Don't worry, we got there. Just takes a little bit of time for me. <laughs> Look at all that damage I'm doing. Did I know that Alan's... That Alan has a Mega, Char Mega Charizard X? I did. I remember that episode too, when Ash found out that he did too. Please don't let me die. Thank you. One of my newest figures is a Digimon figure. It's. Aww. Let me look at. I'll look up what that looks like. Takato. Hold on, I gotta. And... Oh, that's 
so cute. I had to remember. I couldn't remember what it was. Oh. Oh shit! I should have roosted. I think I'm okay. I am okay. You can't screech. That's so cute. The figures are also super duper expensive for zero. You gotta find like deals on them and everything. I eventually wanna actually like, cause we do have figures, but I wanna start like a figure collection for us once we have more space. I do have a um, Midoriya one. I love the third Digimon series, it's good. It's all good. Digimon, Digimon, Thank God. Uh, I'm gonna cheer heal up for all of us. Cause I don't think that you should die, Vaporeon. Ah. Uh. Come on, guys. We got this. Yes. Nice. He's shell smashing too early. Nice. Someone just smack him in the head. Someone, please, for God's sake, help the como o Yes, okay, cool. We broke it. We broke the shield. I keep reaching for this can. There's nothing in this can. One of my new favorite stores is Hot Oh, I love Hot Topic. I will never not love Hot Topic. Just saying. Hot Topic will always be in my heart. They have good stuff, too. Uh, rain dance, someone. Oh my god, of course. It's gonna release. Oh, ow, that hurt. Ow. <laughs> that was me attempting to, to rage at that raid. Attempting. Yeah, I love Hot Topic. I also like, um... Ooh, lounge flies. I have two lounge flies, I think. You also should take a look at Boxed Lunch. Even just looking at their website. Boxed Lunch is also a really, really good store. And every time you buy from Boxed Lunch... Uh, a, a certain amount, I believe, I don't know what the the amount is, but, um, it goes towards buying a lunch for a child that can't afford it. And they also have a lot of different, uh, lounge flies as well. Lounge fly is a blessing. I don't want to look at Hot Topic things. They have really good, uh, like, fits as well. I want to buy BMO, uh, <laughs> overalls so bad, but I haven't done it yet, and I don't know if I will, because I really, <sighs> I don't know. Ugh. Oh. Oh my god, the, what's it called? The, uh, the Pom Pom Purin lounge fly. So good. Alright, let's change our Pokemon to be Corviknight. I don't think Corviknight's the problem. I won't lie to you guys. I'm ready. We have a Gallade. We should be fine. Should 
keyword. But if we're not, I also will not be shocked. Come on, we're all ready to go. Why? Why is it always abandoned? Always. I also really have to go pee, but the code is in the shower. I can't even check for new postings. Such a disappointment. All around. <laughs> Now I have to wait to see if this is... Oh, of course. Of course. Change my Pokemon. Ready to go. Ah. Of course it's been abandoned. I will be right back. <laughs> BRB for like two seconds. Okay. I am back. No need to fret. And I know you guys are fretting. <laughs> Alright. Let's see if we can actually join one. I literally need to join one. Because I need an herb. So bad, it hurts. Ah! Please! Let me in, and don't take me out! The BMO thing I wanted is out of stock anyway. What a sad day. <laughs> it's fine. Okay. Laying back and comfy in my seat. I am comf. Nice. Alright, we should all be good. Thank God. 
let's hope that we can we can do this. Cause God forbid, if I keep not getting herb, I'm gonna be real upset. All right, we got this. We got this. We got this. Even a shiny Gallade? If that's not luck, I don't know what luck is. Oh boy. I really probably could use Walking Week in this, but I feel like in order to live, Corviknight's just better. Overall. I drove pump. Nice. Whack. Boom. Alright. One down already. Just gonna keep booping. My little body press. We're getting somewhere. Uh. Yeah, I guess I'll just keep body pressing. And then I'll roost next one. Because at least it's doing like a little bit of damage. You have no negative effects on yourself. Alright, let's roost. Ooh! It's okay. Don't worry, guys. I'm fine. I will, in fact, do the heal cheer, though. Because I'm a team player! Come on, everyone. Heal up. Yeah, we're all gonna need to heal up again. I think we're okay. Never mind. Little little Gambit is not. I forgot what his name is. The pre-evolution of King Gambit. What is his name? Bisharp. <laughs> I called him Little Gambit. <laughs> uh. How funny. That's good. Alright. I think we're okay. I lied. I'm gonna roost. I'm gonna die too. It didn't show my HP that low, by the way. Remember when I said we were fine? I must have lied. Okay, I'm gonna do a defense cheer. Because that's what we need, I think. Because we cannot keep dying. This Bisharp is not having a good time. He keeps dying. Oh boy. <laughs> yep, sure isn't. All right, nice. 
we don't have enough time. I fear. I need to roost too. So if I don't, then we're really fucked. Okay. That's fine. My god, is that a crit? And it released the energy. In case you wanted to know what it's like to watch the collapse of a Pokemon streamer, this is it. This is 100% it. My skittle dropped on the ground. Strictly unlucky time. Try this. Now I'll go with Walking Lake. Fuck it. Don't know why someone went Azumarill. Ash's Infernary is broken with Blaze. You think so? So also totally could have gotten Corviknight, but it's fine. We're doing our best. Heal us up. No one die, please. I need all of you to live. Damn it. Everyone heal, please. I'm so hopeful. I heard a cat noise. Guys, heal yourselves up. I have no more. I have no more things 
Thank you. I also don't have Cleaver in this game yet. So I think it'll be good to get it. Unless we all start dying. Is Iron Hands just chillin'? We can do this, guys. I cannot win a raid. I'm convinced, I just can't. Actively convinced. Those ones did seem easier and faster to do, though. Of course, I always end up going back to Blastoise. Of course. My tongue hurts so bad actively bad. Excuse me. Ugh. I only have one herb, don't I? Yep. Only one spicy. All right, let's let's look to see what kind of other raids we got around. Any dark raids? That would be a six or seven, probably six. That one seems like it might be good. Let's take a look, see it? Cause I just need one more herb. Just to even make a sandwich. Well, that's just one. Should it be this hard? No. After failing uh, 37,000 raids in a row. Actively. And that's not even an exaggeration. 37,000 times. I, uh... I just wanna- I want shiny totodile. This whole shiny hunt has just been a disaster. I thought Vulpix was a disaster. I was wrong. Mm-mm. Nope. No, uh, Vulpix wasn't even compared to this. Mm-mm. Alright, let's get- 
was just checking if there was any shiny. I believe Dun Dun Sparse is, uh, his shiny is pink too. Right? Dun Dun Sparse is shiny is pink. Hi, Psyduck. Hello, friends. Should shiny hunt for a Meryl at some point. I like a Zoomeril. Of course, not right now, because... We're already on a shiny hunt. Oh, yeah, sure. Ah, uh, Yeah. Alright, so it's an electric type. Uh, where's my other... Look at all these fucking Bruxish. What? Where's my one Venusaur? Because I feel like that Venusaur would be bad here. The Venusaur I got from the raids. Don't mind me, I like breeding Pokemon. That's why I have so many of... Uh, there he is. There's another shiny Bruxish. <laughs> We're just doing our best out here. Truly. I'm gonna put some emotes so the emote wall pops up. I'm just gonna do some. We'll do some of those. Oh, it's only one. Thought it would use more. Alright, let's do. And then for luck, we're gonna do some frog dance. That's our luck. Frog dance luck. Okay. Yeah, I'll start with three. At least I have a few. Alright. We've got this. We're gonna get herb from this raid. We are. Get in. I also like Breloom. I like Shiny Azumarill. Just a happy little sunshine. What does Amnesia do? I don't think that matters here. Like I said, we're trying to we're trying to get those good vibes. Right? For this raid so that we can get some herb. We're dancing like the frogs, baby, dancing like the frogs. This music also does slap a bit. I will say. We've got this. Aerial Ace. That's not cool. Yeah. Oh, I see. The, the shiny Azumarill is... very close to toast. I will heal us up. It failed, because we're already in a grassy terrain. Oh. We're all healing up. 
Super heal. Don't worry, guys. I'll continue to heal you. Yep, I'm dead. Tried. It's up to you guys now. For the next five seconds. Oh boy. I think what doesn't help is the skill dirge. Because, uh, you know, I think we all know. Oh my god, it was already taken out? Jeez Louise. The Azumarill. Azumarill, also not a great choice. In fact, I think the bots pick is better than the actual picks from the real people. But who am I to judge? Why are we doing liquidation? It's fine. <laughs> We're doing our best. That's what matters. Well, I got no more cheers. So, uh... It's already dead. Release your energy. At least this is my raid. Right? Right? I'm feeling so defeated. Remember when I said those frogs were luck? Maybe it was bad luck. I didn't specify which luck it was, to be fair. We tried. I'm gonna try again. Now we're gonna change our Pokemon. Because I don't think that... Uh, I don't think it was a bad pick. But I'm just gonna take a look. If anything else could have been better. Uh, like, could Excadrill be better? A garage home. What's up? The hooks. Oh. All right, let's let's try this again. Let's start. These Pokémon picks certainly look a lot better. <laughs> I'm hopeful. Ah, yes, eBay. Thank you for my lovely little email. <laughs> Wow. I didn't even realize that gold eagle was so shiny. Nice. I keep looking over at the screen because I keep thinking that someone's typing in chat. And no one is, which is fine. But it's the frogs. Which I find pretty funny. I don't remember what grass moves it knows. Grass moves.
passing terrain, that's fine. It really is. Yeah, Garchomp! Hit him with the earthquake! Didn't do that much damage. Landris is already asleep. Poor Landa. Rage Fist! Low speed? I don't even know what that does. I guess my speed fell low. Alright, I'll heal us up next. Oh, Lando died. That's not great. Well, at least they're doing damage. Heal up! Sitting crisscross applesauce in my chair now. That's how you know we're getting serious. Hate it when it goes loud in my ears. Ooh. Not my Terra Orb Charge. Come on, Garchomp. Wake up, buddy. You got this. Okay. Never mind. I lied. Someone just killed the fucking Breloom. <laughs> you can't keep doing this. I can't keep losing. I'm on such a losing streak. Okay, what if I cheer go all out? And then... And then someone will be bound to beat him, right? Spore? Well, I guess I'm asleep. And he's gonna release his energy. What a sad day. <sighs> now all I can hear is the noises on the white screen. Oh my god, please. <laughs> Third time's a charm, right? You just see me start crying. <sighs> I think Venusaur was better. Maybe. <laughs> I'm so defeated, but I'm trying not to be defeated. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're just gonna try and do Venusaur again. It's Amazenta, huh? <sighs> I'm ready, but I'm gotta wait.
All right, another person. That's what I'm talking about. Now we just gotta wait for the last person. Jump. Oh, another person. Sick. Let's go. All right, guys, select your your mon. We've got this. Uh, okay. I don't know why he picked Penchurchum, but okay. But okay. Oh, I like the shave head look. Mine is not shiny. Dauntless Shield. We have, I, it's me and three Japanese players. All right, nice. Oh no, how how is your ranked journey going? Is it not going well? Nice, nice. Come on, just keep doing damage, guys. I just got in my first game, but we'll let you know. Good. Good. I hope it goes well. I don't know exactly what this Venusaur is trying to do. Not me. I'm, I'm a good Venusaur. I, I meant the other one. Okay, I'm just gonna keep smacking. I'm still okay. Come on! Negative effects from its flow, that's fine! Not my Terra Orb Charge, how could you? Uh, it stresses me out. Electric terrain is good. Because then it's not grass. Alright, let's go. Everyone, full fledged attack. We need to take out this Breloom because if we don't, I'm going to have a mental breakdown. And that's a threat and a promise. Why are we using Giga Drain? Okay, heal up. So we all live just a little bit longer. Okay. I'm gonna heal us all up again. Because if one of us dies, one of us dies. But I just... Can we break the curse? Maybe someone cursed me. 
Maybe that's the problem here. They cursed my Pokemon game. Huh. Everyone, get the Breloom. Yes, someone whack him one more time. I have to cheer. I don't want to risk anything. I'm so stressed. So stressed. It's been like 10 of these fucking games. These ranked. Or not ranked, these raids. Got this. We're good. We're fine. Get him. Oh, yes, that was good. Earth power. Oh. You guys see how beautiful that just was? So beautiful. About to say someone just whack him, flip him on his forehead, like that. Oh my god! What a nightmare! Oh. <sighs> All right, everyone, you can either catch the mushroom turtle or not. I'm going to catch the mushroom turtle. Please give me an herb. Please give me an herb. Please. Bonk. Now we're adventuring into Kitakami. To try again to get an herb. I think Walking Lake is fine. Because it's rock, right? That one's rock? I believe so. Ugh. Alright. Let's see if we'll be blessed this game, shall we? She's very hopeful. I like how I was talking about Yu-Gi-Oh! And all of a sudden Yu-Gi-Oh! stuff pops up on my Twitter. We've loved you, Gio. I just, man. All right, guy has a rever room. His name is Nozomi. That's Raul. Ba, 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 ba. You too. All right. 
you want a Mewtwo, you can play a Mewtwo. I'm ready. I don't know if you guys are ready. Raul, you might want to pick another Pokemon, brother. But if you don't want to, I respect it. Zomi, you know? I think... I almost called him Chargeable. <laughs> Iron Hands. Should be fine. I swear to god, my brain is so fried from doing these goddamn raids. When all a homie wants to do. All a homie wants to do is hunt for a shiny toted isle. But this game said, and they quote, no. Sorry. You may not. You may not shiny toted isle, and instead we're gonna give you five shiny Bruxish. Five. My poor Totodile. I'm sorry, Totodile. I have a huge Totodile in the back. <laughs> I just heard Dakota go, I'd be pissed. So I guess the, the ranked game isn't going that bad. Ooh, shiny. Terra cannon? Terra Tachyon. Terracon. Oh, it's normal type. Yeah, I guess that's fine. I have so much faith. When I say yeah, I have so much faith. Everyone, get the Mandibuzz. Dark Pulse, that's fine. If he wants to... to... Uh, attack me, that's fine. Snarl. That's fine. That's fine. Everyone's special attack is falling. He tried to use Snarl again. Actually, it works, I guess. I am the only special attacker here. So I guess I will just continue to cheer. Alright, someone whack him. Toxic. Britney Spears is up in here. Sorry, that was not a good joke. You can tell how chaotic I'm feeling because of my hair in this right now. Alright guys, don't worry. I'll do a heal. That should cure us all of our heal our, our poison, right? Or does it not? Does it only cure sleepy? Doesn't matter. He, he just oh, took that fucker out. Take him out! Oh no, my special attack. How am I supposed to take him out now? Jesus Christ. Yeah! Yeah! Woo! Alright, now give me the herb I desire. I don't want to catch it. I don't like Mandibuzz as a Pokemon either. Oh my fucking... Jesus. I'm going to rage. I'm gonna have a meltdown. Uh, uh.
Nope. Oh. Nope. 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 Uh. I guess I'll try that one. And then if that doesn't work, I guess we're stuck on uh, uh, Blastoise raids. With daylight savings time, I'm all I'm all messed up. <laughs> Cause it feels like it's only one o'clock, but it's two o'clock. Golem. So anything fighting would be good. I could bring Hitman top. Oh, I'm not going to bring... I was thinking about Annihilate, but... No. Not Blaziken. Arcanine? No. That doesn't make sense. It's dark. Fairy? I could try Flutter Man. I'm just gonna wait for a few more people. I think Dakota's game is going well. He just said it is a top canyon. Holy shit. Oh! Sounds like someone did not have a good time. Oh, they left. Isn't that just a joy? When someone le comes and then leaves. Ah! They're back. Ah, beautiful. A four stack, as the kids say. Ah. Sand slash. Okay. And Taurus. This is dark, right? Yeah. There's a psychic? Oh, it's dark. Yeah, it's dark. I'm not dumb. Well. Oh, look at the shiny sand slush. He's red. Ding. Couldn't tell by the Taurus. Tauros. I'm just gonna start whacking. That's heartwarming. I'm gonna do that. I didn't realize it would have heavy slam. That's unfortunate. Alright gang, you got this. Why would you use Night Slash? How did you get frozen? All of these questions. I guess I'll try again. Man, Flutterman 
is not the mod to pick. But the thing is, is the, the other guy is basically trolling. How unfortunate. Golurk's down, Sandslash is basically down. Yeah, but why don't I hit him with another Moonblast? Oh, that's heartwarming. Hey, super effective. Good night, world. And one... Sure isn't. And we're all about dead. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Maybe I'll use Corviknight for that one. That doesn't seem like a bad idea. We'll try it again, but with Corviknight. But I'm gonna run to the bathroom again. BRB! <laughs> Tell your friends, Tay Cheech is back, Tay is back, Pay is back, Tay is back, Tay is back. We're doing Corviknight this time. Now we just gotta wait for friends to join. And I have Body Slam, or whatever it is. Just a little, a little Mbopex. Oh, a soar soaring moon? Is that what it's called? Roaring moon? Roaring or soaring? One of the two. Fun fact, they have a, a whole thing for just large Pokemon plush now. If anyone wants the Lucario one, it's in stock. Uh, yeah, let's just do this. Hello! A- Abba Crummy? A- Abba Crummy? Am- Amba Crummy? A- Abba Creamy. Abba Creamy. Sorry, I'm very bad with names. I do my best, though. Hi, and welcome to the stream. Happy Sunday fun day. How is your day going, my friend? Today, right now, I'm doing raids to get more herb, because I'm trying to shiny hunt Totodile. It's not going the best. We have gotten five shiny Bruxish, so. But we're doing our best. Uh, I'm going to screech, actually. Abba? Okay. Sounds good with me. <laughs> I'm so bad at pronouncing names, it hurts. Ugh. Oh, they already took out our Roaring Moon? 
Doing fine and awaken from my slumber. Feel that. We did not have a good night's sleep last night. Because of daylight savings. So I am. Whew. I was up from like uh because for work I usually wake up around 650. But uh <laughs> it was just not not a time. I woke up from like f at like five and six. You guys need to heal yourselves up. Agreed with you. It's just, it's such a, it's such a time. But you know what? The sun is gonna be in the sky a lot longer, which is nice. I will say, I do enjoy that. But I know it's already going to be... Oh, I beat myself up. Dynamic punch, it's fine. I also have beaten one raid out of like 20 today. Just to get some herb. And I, I've, been, I've been doing my best. It's been a little toughy. Huh, <sighs> but... Yeah. I, we went to bed at, like, 9 last night to try and, like, counteract the, the daylight savings. It did not go hot. Like I said, we were good until, like, what would be 4.30 in the morning, 5.30 in the morning. We were like, ah! Hello, I'm awake now. And we have cats. Cats woke us up as well. Which is, you know, to be expected when you own cats. But now they're all asleep, because they were up all night. I expected? I think so. <laughs> Curse, huh? Like I said, I just want herb, and this game is oh, cursing me. As... We're all just doing our best out here. At least that's what I believe. Oh, come on. We, we've we got this. Come on, guys. We've got this. My morale is going down slowly, slowly, slowly. Go, like just let us go yeah all right let's try again i have a feeling that this golurk is going to give herb though i just have a feeling i just got this feeling this hopeful feeling very hopeful ha <laughs> ha it's like i'm going crazy Okay, we're going to try it again. Let anyone join. That must be why people uh, abandon raids so much. Because they're probably annoyed by people trolling. And I don't know if people like actually troll on purpose. Or if they just troll on accident. You know what I mean? Like they don't know any better. It's very plausible. People are going to join my raid and it's going to be great. Oh. Stretch. Huh. I've literally been doing raids for like the last hour and a half. Trying to get an herb. A bunch of it was Blastoise ones though. I wish I knew Katakana as well as Hiragana. I know the middle one is like, why like, you? Pedro! And I know that goes well with this raid, but have it. 
and your shell bell by having your Pokemon hold. Oh, the more you know. I'll if this one doesn't work, then I'll try that. I like going Corviknight only because I don't die as often because it's so bulky. And a lot of the time in these raids, I see the problem as being people die too often, as we just saw. And so, my goal is to just not die. Because I used to die a lot in raids, <laughs> to the point where I would be so embarrassed. And I'd be like, I'm sorry, people must see the name Tay, and they just leave. First game was a hard W. I thought you were already done with that game. I heard you say Top Canyon. Like, feels like a, a half hour ago. Oh, there's an Annihilate. Alright, sick. Oof, oof, oof. I feel like leftovers wouldn't be bad either. I had life. I have life orb on my uh, my one Pokemon, my walking wake, and I didn't realize it. And I was just losing health. I was like, oh no, I didn't mean it. Ching. I feel like everyone has a shiny Iron Hands at this point. I could have a shiny Iron Hands, truly. But alas, I'm forgetful. Maybe I should next do a shiny something. Iron hands is okay and relies on physical moves. Can even learn to stand up. Oh, cool. I should get, because iron hands is also used a lot in like VGC. So maybe that'll be another shiny hunt. But, like, the, the shiny between regular Iron Hands and not Iron Hands is... Man, it always confuses me. I shouldn't hit myself. Because it's not an attacking move, I feel like. Alright, go like I got you. That's fine. Just let me roost. All right, we're hopeful. Uh oh, rest in peace, Iron Hands. Of course I'm confused. Why would I not be confused? Oh, goodbye, your speed. Hello, your attack. Can't even use anything yet. I. <laughs> All right, let's try. Let's heal up, because I feel like we all need a good heal up. I feel like that's a solid move. Nice. Collision course. Whoosh. All right, we're so fine. Let's do a body press. We're all doing a lot of damage, so this is good. I hit myself. I just can't escape the curse of this game, I suppose. Alright. Literally, just twap him. Just twap him on the forehead with this body press. There we go. Woo! I have a feeling this is gonna give herb. This is gonna give us what we need. Right here, right now. Whoosh. Golurk, I, I'm sorry. You've caused me so much pain. I do not even want to catch you. Yay! 
Yes! The herb we needed. Back to the shiny hunt. God damn it. Whew, feeling good. We're feeling good now. Better. Refreshed. Renewed. Okay. We're gonna go boop. Oh, I was in Blueberry Academy. Alright, we are... Let's go here. Yes. I know where I have to go. We're back on the shiny hunt. Uh, I go this way. I think, right? Or is it lower? Might be this way. I do not remember. Sorry, Trapinch. I didn't mean to run into you, buddy. Maybe it's up here. What? What? Oh my god, arena trap. Good night, trap inch. Just such towering defeat. Yeah, it's fine. Perhaps it's up here? Apparently I do not know where I am ever. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Rowlet! Please. I don't want to hurt a little gentleman. Ah. Come on, where is it? It's over here. Might be over here. What's... Is that it right over there? I think so. Is that it right over there? Yep, sure is. Just got lost for a second. But we have been found! Alright. On we go to the 8th sandwich. God forbid. We get shiny totodile in this one. God forbid. Make a Sammy. One, two, three, four, five. For shoot. Too spicy. Next. Silver pick. Shudo goes first. Come on, grab the pursuit. Hi, Ryan. All is going okay. I just spent the last hour and a half uh, losing at raids because <laughs> I'm I was trying to get an herb for my eighth shiny sandwich. I uh. <laughs> Unfortunately, I've not gotten shiny totodile yet, and instead I've gotten four shiny bruxish. Had to turn in an assignment today. What kind of assignment? Was it at least a fun one? Or not so? Was it not so fun? Or we're just glad it's over? Because I also had those assignments. Don't fall off, cucumber. Thank you. Oh, Ooh, gotta be careful. Careful, careful, careful. Gentle. Gentle, gentle, gentle. Yes. I haven't turned it in yet. Ah. Is it what is it due by midnight tonight? I also loved it when I was in college and professors were like, uh, just recording music in a certain way. Oh, that's fun. Mm -hmm. 
Is that something that you're super passionate about? Oh, sorry, I don't mean to yawn. Those fucking raids took it out of me, I guess. Water is good. Alright. We're packing and going. Yes, it is. Well, I'm glad. Is that like your major in uh, school right now? Or is it just like an assignment that someone is like, do this? <laughs> Not that that makes much sense, but you, I, I, you know. Get the total dial. I'm so happy to be shiny hunting and not doing any more raids. God damn. Okay. It's your major? Good for you. My major in college was uh, broadcast and mass communications. That's why I enjoy streaming so much. <laughs> and making videos. Because that was my major. If I could make it a career one day, that'd be cool. I mean, technically it is my career, because I make videos for a company. So I guess I'm living out a dream. A dream. But it took me a while to, to get where I am, so. Because God for fucking bid. My, uh, my major was not the... It was not the best major when I was in college. Because the school I went to was very good for, for broadcasting. And I liked all the classes that I took for it. But, um, it's just very, very competitive. And, uh, as I had to graduate during COVID, um, I unfortunately was unable to get, like, internships until after I graduated college. And those internships were not paid. So, thanks for that. Uh, unpaid internships. And unpaid inter internships should be illegal, by the way. Because you shouldn't have someone do work for free. Even it's, if it's, like, a little. Like, on a commission-based pay. Like, but I've done... I did, like, three separate free internships. And it was unfortunate. So, my advice to anyone who is in college or planning to go to college, don't take any unpaid internships. But internships are important. So do an internship. At this point, everyone has gotten their masters before me because finishing music composition takes way longer. That's fair. I almost went to get my masters, but I didn't. Because I just... I mean, I could go back and get it. But... That seems like a whole lot of silly money. But maybe I could. I mean, the thing is, is like, I enjoy streaming and making videos. And if I could bring Matt into my career, that'd be pretty sick. Because working for someone isn't always the best. Oh my god. But I mean, they could also get you insurance and stuff. and It's all just unfortunate. I know that for the grad program, if I were to do a grad program, um, it would be like running a, a page or something, like doing videos, and I already do that as a career, and I just, uh, I just, I also don't know how much money it would be, you know? And that'd be another two years of my life. You know, I'm already busy enough as it is. <laughs> but maybe one day. What hunt am I doing right now? I am hunting Totodile. Still, this is sandwich number eight of doing Totodile. Because, God forbid. I, I've gotten five shiny Bruxish, but no shiny Totodile yet. But we're trying. Doing our best. Feels, something feels tight on my head and I don't know what it is. Alright, there's that. Woo! There we go. 
comes to Snivy. Hi, Snivy. Is Shiny Snivy cool? I don't think I've ever taken a gander at it. At least I don't think so. Alright, this is a big pond. Pokemon gotta start spawning. Especially Toted Isles. Not just Bruxish. And Dewpiters. Nice. Hello? Hello, Trollo556. How are you doing today? How is your Sunday going, my friend? Right now we are shiny hunting Totodile. Oh no, and getting Totodile outbreaks is very hard when you change the time. Yeah, I don't... I don't do the outbreaks just because, uh... You know. I mean, it would probably be easier, but... I, like, for me, I'm like, eh, you know, outbreaks. It's a Sunday. That is very fair. It's still better than the week. True. Weekends are... Like, the, like, everyone loves a good weekend, right? You get free time. You, Sundays, though, you have to get ready for the week, so. It's very, uh, conflicting. But I still like a good Sunday. Sunday is also a co very cozy time. Plus, I had Friday, no school. Ah, oh, good for you. It's always fun being able to have a long weekend. I get to go on vacation at the end of March, and I am so excited to just be able to not do anything and just relax. So what about starters you haven't shiny hunted yet? I have only shiny hunted Cyndaquil. And I was successful with Cyndaquil. Now I'm doing Totodile. Oh, uh... So, I'm thinking about next of shiny hunting... Uh, Rowlet, or perhaps, uh, I almost said Blitzcrank, like the League of Legends character. <laughs> um, or Bulbasaur, I like Bulbasaur a lot. Woman's Day is an international holiday in two regions of Germany. <sighs> you know, every day I think I grow a little bit more angry at America. Good for Germany, though. Honestly, that's a, that's a great, that's, uh, huh, it should, it should be an internet, International Women's Day should be off for all women. Well, and everyone, everyone gets to celebrate women. We all do it. But good for Germany. So you're having a long weekend. Only two from, I don't know how many. Not enough. Not enough. International Women's Day is... is cool. Well, I'm not sure if stream will last that- Like, what do you mean? Like, if I'll do another shiny hunt? I... don't even know if I'll get shiny toted in this stream, quite honestly. Ye. Oh dear, I didn't mean to run into Dewpiter. But yeah, good for Germany. Live love. I wonder what other countries do that. Because America doesn't. And we all know why America doesn't. Bruxish? Please. But yeah. I'm, I'm excited for, for my vacation because I just get to, I just get to chill. Very rarely in my life have I truly taken, like, a lot of days off. Whenever I take days off of work, I, I feel bullies. I'll definitely assist you with the Bulbasaur hunt if you're okay with it. I mean, what, how, how can people help me assist? I also probably won't shiny hunt for Bulbasaur today, but just, like, eventually. Hi, Tiki. Still better than my school finding out I'm trans. My bullies bullying me because of my preferred name. Totally didn't. Man. People are assholes. I'm sorry. 
Well, just know that in this stream, in any- Hi, honey. And in any sort of channels, this is a safe space. And for that to happen is unacceptable. Like, I make a sandwich for you and you hunt it? I mean, yeah, that'd be fine. I didn't know that you could do that. Hi, hon. This is Tiki. Oh, you okay? Mwah. Tiki is both a menace and my love. I have to move the Skittles because of you. Yes, you cannot have Skittles. I know, you cannot have Skittles. Looks like Tiki woke up and wanted attention. Wait, a cool cat you have is a pet. Yeah, I have three cats. Tiki was just the first one that we got. She is three years old. Uh, and a tuxedo cat. Karibo is bl also black and white, but not a tuxedo. He's a long haired cat. He's two. Turning two. Oh! Hey, troll! Thanks for the follow! I very much appreciate it. Dying inside? Don't die inside. Because just know that you have people on your side no matter what. You know? There are going to be people that don't like you for literally no reason. But you will have people that will always support you. And like I said, this is a safe space. Oh, and Toji is also a tuxedo cat. Also, if you're confused at who I'm talking to, I'm streaming on both YouTube and Twitch. So, I have them on my dual monitors. Hi, baby girl. But yeah, that's Tiki. Thought so, yeah. But it's like, I had a hard time myself with people just not liking me for no reason. And I still kind of do struggle with that from time to time. I'm a big people pleaser. So. Did I know the first trans clinic was in Berlin? I did not know that. Is, is Germany more, um... Are they more or less accepting of kids that are, or I guess people that are LGBTQ+. Because it's hard to keep up with everyone's thing. But that's really cool that it was in Berlin. Hi, baby girl. Such a good girl. She's just laying on my desk, looking at me. Tiki. She's a tuxedo cat. And Toji's also a tuxedo cat. He is eight years old. And all the cats are adopted. Cause adopt, don't shop. Nice. Way to go, walking like. Oh, such a good girl. She's so tired. Are you so tired? Tiki will always, like, 99% of the time make an appearance on my stream. Because she just wants attention. She's my biggest fan. Truly. I would say yes, although also Germany wants to add a law in which it would make it easier for trans people to change their gender and name for free. Good for Germany. I wish the United States could even... I mean, shit, we don't even have free healthcare. Like, there's so little resources. I mean, there are resources. But there's, like, you don't, like, know. It's not, like, an open conversation that really it needs to be. Because people treat it as such, like, an odd thing. And it's not. <laughs> it's, it's really not. Uh, you just are who you feel that you are. And I don't think that should be anybody else's business. And they should treat you with respect. Because 
they should. There's no reason for them not to treat you with respect. Or call you by your preferred name. Preferred name. Isn't that right, Tiki? We say trans rights. Yes. Protect trans kids. Isn't that right, honey? Yeah. The healthcare in Germany is better same with school. I 100% believe it. No doubt. The the schooling of uh, kids in America has gone 100 has gone uh, so bad. And especially like the violence in America also so bad. Thank you, Tiki. Goodbye, Tiki. <laughs> Sorry, she <laughs> she goofed up some things before leaving. Yeah, that's Tiki. So about the sandwich, as I mentioned, yes, no, but maybe next. Yeah, I mean, if 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 you want to make the the sandwich for the next one, that that should be fine. Does it technically give like I didn't know you could shiny hunt with other friends too. But yeah, I don't really um sure. Yeah, whenever, after I do Shiny Totodile, if you want to and you're here, that should be fine. I don't have a problem with it. I don't see why not, you know? I just can't with these. In Germany, you have to be in school till grade 9. But can do till 12th grade. I'm in. For Germany, you have to be in school till grade 9. But can do till 12th grade. I'm on the way from 10th grade. Oh. Interesting. It's, a, it's also really funky to find out about other countries' school programs. And how truly different they are to America's. Because we go up to 12th grade as well. You can't be homeschooled in Germany. Well, more you know. Here's the thing. Have you unlocked all of the stuff from the computer on the leak? Uh, not all of it. I still have to do some BBQs. I haven't just because I've... Right now, all I have is um the Savannah biome unlocked. And I have the... Ice biome, polar biome unlocked. College and university are also free, as they should. As they should. Nobody should be in debt for needing to go to college, because it's so hard to get like a per like a career that isn't like retail or food service without going to college. It's just unfortunate. For America. Oh, Tiki scratched me and it hurt. She didn't mean to, she just slipped, but now my little arm hurts. Get the dupe hider. Boy golly, this freaking A lot of things should be free that cost money. Such as uh you know, healthcare, college, uh, necessities, such as, like, I mean, everyone uses toilet paper. I want to do something with kids. Do you want to, like, be a teacher? Or maybe, like, a counselor, a mentor, someone that just helps kids? That's really good. Wanting to do something with kids? No, not a teacher. Yeah, I don't blame you. <laughs> that was just the first thing I thought of. Dakota wanted to be a teacher at one point, and then, uh... He, he said, uh, no. I don't want to be a teacher anymore. I think we have to do something with animals still. Or business. I don't know. What else is there? There's like a counselor, a mentor in a certain thing. 
certain thing. Teachers make really good money in Germany. Good as they deserve to. They deserve to. Teachers are one of the least paid uh, occupations in America, it feels like. When they're literally shaping, helping shape the generation. Which is ridiculous. Fire sandwich would work. And I know what starter would be easy to get. What what starter? Oh, thank you. I like my layout. They're fun. It's fun. I made it myself, actually. So, it warms my heart for you to say that. Can make, like, 2,000 euros a month. Jeez. Is that a lot of euros? I don't know what euros translates to in American dollars. I wonder what German history teachers talk about. <laughs> you know? Good point. So, about... About some Austrian guy? I forget Austria is a place, too. That's a good point, though. What... Like... I wonder what... It's so funky. I bet you, like, all different places. The bad man is from Austria. Ch sure! I always forget that certain places are a thing. I'm also happy that my follow sound worked. It's worked like all day. Just like, what? <laughs> uh, so silly. No, thank you. You know who I'm talking about. Yeah, I, I, I believe that I do, yeah. Charmander. Oh, Charmander's a good one. I also really like, um, Shiny Charizard's probably the best. Yeah, but no need to say. Yeah, true. True. Badman. I like that his, that's his nickname. Okay. I am Diamond 2. I'm proud of you. Did you win the second game then? She knows. Ba, 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 da, ba, da. Oh yeah. Hell yeah. Are you playing another? Ari got carried hard as fuck. That's fair. Uh, Dakota plays League of Legends. It, Dakota is Arborous. No, I think I'm okay. That's, that's fair. I am super content. <laughs> Good, I'm glad. Next is the- when does the season end? Do you think you'll be able to get Masters? Or, I guess Challenger. But I guess Masters the next step up. Or Grandmaster. Grandmaster. That's the one. Germany talks about so much in their history. In America, we- we- we certainly talk a lot. Whether or not it's all of our hi true history <laughs> is up to be debated. Masters 100% and it ends in a few months. Oh, you definitely have time then. For sure. Also, are we having Jambalaya tonight? For our game board night? Board game night? I don't really care about German history. I like cute things. And not hate or war. Uh, listen, man. Same. All cute things are wonderful. Also, if I may ask... Okay, so your pronouns are she, her? And I, I apologize if that came off uh, wrong. I say man for all genders. Okay. Then I shall refer to you as... She, her. Good on you. I am also she, her. And that is important to ask. Did you trip on something? I don't think Dakota heard me. <laughs> I hate Bruxish with the passion. But yeah, I agree. Uh, war sucks. <laughs> 
wholeheartedly. You say man like when people say dude for all people. Yes. I sure do. And I get that, I think, from my uncle. It's okay, you just call me bro. I'm okay, that's fair. I, I, I go dude, bro, everyone is, everyone is everything. I have a shiny Bruxish. I have five shiny Bruxish. <laughs> and that's not even a flex. I don't even want them. But I have five of them. I just, that's how bad this, uh, this shiny hunt has gone. <laughs> oh, Karibo! You've made it out of the closet. How was your nap, buddy? My cat is currently making his way out of the closet. I got that on your birth. Oh, good for you. Come here, bud. Hi. Oh, my little buddy. Oh. Say hi to the stream. <gasps> You're so tired. Mwah. Say hi. Say hi. Hi. Okay, you can go now. Be free. <laughs> I want to have a bunny as a pet. I once had a bunny. Uh, his name was Sebastian. Sebastian lived to be about five years old, I believe. He was a black bunny with little brown paws. He was very cute. My first shiny in this game was a fail. Oh no. What was, what was it? My first shiny in this specific game was a pommy. Tell your YouTube chat they're cute. Like, tell them the bunnies are cute? Or just that my YouTube chat is cute? Hey, YouTube chat, you're cute. Everyone deserves to be told that they're cute every once in a while. No, that you're Yeah, okay, yeah, I got you, I got you now. Just let me know when you're ready and I'll whip it up. Well, like I said, I don't... Because I want to do Totodile first, so we might have to do that next stream, uh, Abba, if that's okay. Because, just because right now I'm so focused on, <laughs> on Totodile, and I have no herb left. It's so upsetting, <laughs> but it's fine. My first shiny was a Sneasel. I like Sneasel. I found shiny Toxicroak, and when I was trying to catch it, I didn't know if I could save in front of the shiny, it would stay. So I went to it, my team was under- Oh no! Oh, that's a heartbreaker. That is a heartbreaker. Sneasel's a good shiny too. Okay, that's fine. Okay, cool. Glad to hear it, but we will try that out next time. Next time after I get shiny Totodile. When that will be, I don't know. I want shiny Toto so bad. My first, the first Pokemon I shiny hunted for in this game was Gloom. And I don't remember who I got. Yeah, so I think four days after the release of the game. Can you blame me for not knowing? No, I can't blame you. I can't even remotely blame you. I also played Violet wrong, where I accidentally uh, went to the wrong place because it doesn't have like a clear map, you know And I went to a place where my Pokemon were vastly vastly under leveled So I had to level them up to be able to beat them and then I had to face the under gyms And I just thought that the po the game was really hard But uh, I was wrong I did the earth titan with level oh what Pokemon did you beat it with? Are you okay? <laughs> Dakota sounded like he just fell. <laughs> Jeez Louise. Sia, enjoy the vibes. Oh, thank you. You enjoy your day. Quaxley's first evolution. I don't even know what Quaxley's first evolution. I know the last one. I don't remember the middle one. The name. Yeah, I went to get Grusha for the third gym and I didn't know what I got into. Literally. I thought I was walking the right way the whole time. I, I alas, was not. I had walked the wrong way. But hey. 
it's better. Oh, the lag. Oh, no. Get it. I'm being attacked, Walking Wake. Thank you. What is happening? So many things are falling. I also, my third, quack, quacks well. Yes, quacks well. My third was grass. I did the false dragon titan with like, oh, that's pretty good too. Cause that one is, um, false dragon is technically uh, Tatsugiri, right? Or was it Dandozo? That's like one of the only ones I remember. Cause that one was a toughie for me. I literally couldn't beat it, and I couldn't beat it because I was under- uh, underleveled. It's both, yeah, okay. Dandozo and Tatsugiri. That makes sense. I also want to say that next stream, because I stream every, uh, Saturday and Sunday, is going to have- I have to add fake flowers, but I'm gonna have fake flowers and new shelves there, so it's less bare. And it's gonna be fun and cute, and I'm very excited. You know what? At least I didn't get another shiny Bruxish. That's really the... Yet, the fucking sushi is a dragon and not the catfish. True. The tiny little fish dragon. The sushi. <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. You know Pokemon. I mean, not only that, but the, the big-ass palm tree is a dragon <laughs> and not the one that looks like a dragon which is charizard it's uh it's the pokemon way i i've been you know we've all been crescent <laughs> with the pokemon way oh golly that's too funny there's like no for oh there's a totodile I hate my life right- why is that? What's the matter? I hear a cat. Got a little freaked out for a second. I like knowing where my cats are. Oh no! I'm sorry. That's the worst when something dies and you're- oh, I'm sorry. Is it possible to get another one? I've never played Ark, but I've only seen a little bit of gameplay of it. I know a lot of people like it. Oh, there goes my fucking shiny sandwich. Ah, it's okay. It's okay. Can't be mad. All we can do is save and hope for the next one. But, yeah, thankfully. Well, I hope you get another one fast. But, as we've been live for four hours, and I have other things I have to do today, such as editing a video on my YouTube channel. Grasslock, so far it's going well. Good, I'm glad. But, I... I'm going to end stream. Play on Switch because I don't have PC. I don't blame you. But that is it for today's stream. I very much appreciate all of you for being here. Wholeheartedly. We had a lot of fun. And you guys are wonderful and fabulous. So thank you so much for the follows. For all the good vibes. I will be streaming on Friday actually. Uh, this week. If you Make sure to follow me on my other social medias. Because that's when you know where I'm going to be going live. Um, but I will be going live, I believe, Friday, Saturday, Sunday next week. So the whole weekend. <laughs> but yeah, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your Sunday. And uh, yeah, keep up the good vibes, gang. Keep up the good vibes.